The following podcast has been rated listener MA. It contains strong language, violence, adult situations, nudity. Listener discretion is advised. Uh, would you rather give up cheese or blowjobs for the rest of your life? <laughs> blowjobs all day. I, I'm the same. I'm fucking Yeah, away. they hurt my jaw. Blank. Rejected name for condoms. Gosh, I don't know. Cock koozies, jizz mittens, ham holsters, kidnappers. Yeah, try it now! <laughs> <laughs> try it, try it now! What's up, everybody? Welcome back to another episode of the Laughing on the Sidelines podcast. I'm your host. My name is Scotty German, a.k.a. Scooter McFuckstick. And alongside me, I have two very good stand-up comedians. You're staring at me like I'm going to say something uh, fucked up. I was waiting for you to tell everybody you were the podcast prodigy. Ah, You gave that up? Yeah. Okay. I get enough. Sh- I get enough shit for making up nicknames for myself. Man, the changes that happen in a week. Yeah, no shit. <laughs> but anyways, I have two excellent stand-up comedians. First, he is a very, very funny man with the uh, severe gambling problem. Please welcome back, Mr. Steve Peter. I'm gambling right now. That's right. I am gamble, gamble. He's making bets right before I, we start the show. I, I, I'll talk about it. Yeah. Week, week. Uh, that's fine. Uh, and then we also have another very, very funny, funny homosexual with a deep voice, Mr. <laughs> JP. That's the best description of me I've ever <laughs> heard in my life. Free. That is so accurate. <laughs> I can't 100%. hear me. I still get, like, we still get comments on, on videos right. well, whenever just, you're talking about it, and it's just secrets. like, he's gay? Still, people don't believe it, and I, I tell them, come yeah. on. Yeah. yeah. I'll show you. <laughs> get that dick out. Oh, my God. See what happens, you know? Mm-hmm. Let me put it in my oh, mouth. Roll it around a little bit. There you go. Well, if you're not already uncomfortable, uh, ladies and gentlemen, if this is the very first time you've listened to, uh, listened to the Laughing on the Sidelines podcast, uh, this is a comedy podcast where we like to make inappropriate jokes about the current events that are going on in sports and inappropriate jokes that have nothing to do with sports whatsoever. In fact, a lot of them are targeted towards me, and I don't care. Uh, but this is also an adult <laughs> podcast where we like to use foul language and offend some people that have thin skin. So if you have thin skin, you're in the wrong place. Get the fuck out of here. Thank you. And bye. What oh. if you were, got weight loss surgery and you just have a lot of extra skin? That's, that's loose true. skin. Yeah, that's, that's loose skin. Can, they, loose. can, can they, anyone can hear my microphone? Because I can't hear me No, at that's all. because uh, you had... Uh, oh, I had Micro. Yep, yeah. Mike, that's, Mike that's, doesn't okay. like to hear Mike me. No, has very true. sensitive ears. How about that? Can you hear I, me now? Yeah, I felt like I was having to yell. I <laughs> didn't know. I was like, oh, it's down too. No, much. no, you're there. You're fine. Okay. Uh, but anyways, we have a great episode for you this week. Uh, we've got some headlines, obviously. Mm-hmm. we got a lot of sports that happened over the week and some controversial shit that we're going to talk about. Uh, mm-hmm. Yeah, we got some yeah. more Never Have I Ever, one. JP's right. favorite segment. That's where I draw the line. Yep. Questions and pregnant questions. They're questions. Yep. Uh, and then we also have a draft. And as always, we uh, wrap things up with a shitty situation. But before we get on to that kind of stuff, we're going to kick off the show as we always do, which we call our week, week recap, where we get to talk talk about what happened to us over the last week and uh jp is back after a long week off man i feel like i haven't been here in two weeks i know (laughs) (laughs) so you surely have done something fun no that's awful isn't that isn't that just pathetic man a little bit a little, a, a little week. Man. I'm not gonna lie. That's why it's. I mean, weak. we. It was Thanksgiving, so I went to my mom's. Yeah, and uh, hung out with the fam. That's it was good. Cool. That's it was, good. It was awesome. I had great, some great food. Yeah, that's kind of the thing uh, that that you didn't have to really travel, did you? No, no. They live, they in, live town. in town. Okay, yeah, yeah, all yeah. right. That's that's no. kind of the thing yeah. because for those people who don't know, in the Wichita area. Like shat eight eight inches of snow. Yeah, yes. dude. Saturday I yeah. left to work at one o'clock. I went straight to the grocery store, then went straight to my dude's house, and uh, then went home. And I didn't leave until what I. What did you do at the guy's house? Monday uh, my my uh, dealer. Oh, oh. <laughs> uh, different dude. Different right. dude. Yeah, the, the yeah, other yeah. dude doesn't exist. Get a but, yeah, so like for two days, I just sat in <laughs> sat in the house and fucking smoked and played fucking video games and Goat Simulator Three. Yeah, I did yeah, play nice. that a little bit. Um, That's so. Fun, it was good, man. man. It was good. I did something. I you remember how I told you last time that I bought a new ball? Yeah. 
Well, I bought another one. <laughs> <laughs> you can't talk shit about my I, fucking dude, board ever again. I have a again. problem, man. I know. I have a do. problem, and I cannot stop. Yeah, I hear you. But, I mean, but is it a good ball? I hope so. I haven't got it yet. Oh, okay. We haven't even tried uh, this one out. No, this one's this one's like, so they, they I know it's not going to make any sense to you, but they banned urethane bowling balls on the on the tour. Oh. So you cannot use a urethane bowling ball. It's made out of urethane. Any particular reason? The, well, because they say that they get softer as they soak up oil, and it's an advantage because it grips the lane better. Oh. Uh, yeah, that's there's why a, I there's, quit bowling. There's a bunch yeah. of different reasons, but now the hardness level has to be at a certain point for you to be able to use urethane. So Storm, my favorite bowling company, just uh -huh. came out with a new urethane ball that's uh, the 73 hardness, which is what it has to be. Okay. And uh, so I, I went ahead and ordered one of those. Of course you did. Because, you know, why not? How yeah. much is a bowling ball like uh, that? About $270. Oh, that's not too bad. No. That's fine. Yeah, that's, that's fine. fine. But he's got But when you got 17 of them, of them well, yeah. You know, then you're saving them for a rainy in day. In three years, I... You know, I think maybe the problem is me and not the ball. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I don't know. But, yeah. yeah. But I've been bowling really good lately. I've yeah. averaged 240 or better for about a couple months now. So. Nice. I had nice. a I had a, a person that I, I ran into uh, at work that says that they bowl at uh, Seneca. I don't even know where you bowl. Yeah, but, that's uh, I bowl. I, oh, is it really? Mm -hmm. um, I, I told him your average, and he was like, holy shit. Like, what, what nights he bowl? Mon Mon or uh, Tuesday nights actually, yeah, so, so yeah, yeah, it doesn't work out. No, I don't see him. Uh, yeah, is but, it one of the service guys? Because uh, I don't know. Boy, how do you could throw one of them in my trunk? You know what I'm saying, <laughs> nah, one one of them. Okay, yeah. <laughs> don't think so. Anyway, <laughs> they're always just sitting there in their little chairs when I come in, looking yeah. sad. Uh -huh. I just want to take them home, make them happy. I'm sure you do. Uh, but anything else? <laughs> Did you have any any controversial conversations at the Thanksgiving table? Nope. I'm shocked. <clears throat> Not really. No. You're a pretty easy, easy going dude. That's just the way yeah, it is. Yeah, man. I don't really. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Well, uh, I also had Thanksgiving, as everybody else did. Um, didn't have to go very far, uh, which was cool. But I got to hang out with a lot of family, which was pretty neat. Um, I watched something that if you are a football fan, you should definitely watch. It's a documentary on Barry Sanders. Yeah, I saw that. On it was my, on Prime. Yeah, I saw that on my Prime. I just dude, haven't got to it yet. Dude, I mean, especially if you're a younger fella. Uh, I mean, when, when you As I am. Yes, yeah, right. <laughs> uh, I, there was a lot of stuff that, I mean, I, whenever I started paying attention to football, it was probably the early 2000s. You know, that's just kind of when I started getting into it. But, like, mm -hmm. Barry was fucking ridiculous. It was a whole new level of running back. And, the, and it's a really cool story. He gives Wichita a lot of shout, like, a lot of props. That's, awesome. um, that's probably because he's from here. Yeah, he is. He's from here. Yeah. That, that's part of the reason why I became a, a Lions I, fan. I, I used to work at Sutherland Lumber Company, and his dad worked in like building houses and stuff like that and he, yep. would, he would come into sutherland's almost every day he was the nicest freaking guy on planet earth he was uh, amazing yeah and he loved being in front of the camera whenever they were talking about barry but it yeah. was yeah. it was a fucking great documentary i highly highly recommend it uh I've heard good stuff about it there's a lot of people i didn't realize they were that pissed off at him in detroit whenever he retired because oh, he shit. oh shit <laughs> i didn't realize how bad it was like the dude didn't like call anybody he just left for London and then faxed his retirement. Email was around back then, by the way. Uh, but he faxed his retirement like uh, um, like paper or whatever. To, I retire. Yeah, to the <laughs> – To, the, to whom am I concerned? Out. No, 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 no. He's, it was actually a friend of his from high school that went to North High with him here oh, in yeah. Wichita. He made sure that the Wichita Eagle was the one to be able to oh, first no report wow. that Barry Sanders was retiring. Wow. Oh, so, wow. That's cool. Everybody was mad at us. And first. now the Wichita <laughs> Eagles about to close. <laughs> oh, so, yeah, exactly. Worked, nice. out well. it worked out well. Worked out really yeah. well. Way to go, Barry. That's all right. Uh, so I did watch that. Uh, we did get, I, I, you said, eight inches of snow. Mm hmm. Um, I measured it with my dick. <laughs> A couple times? Yeah. Figured. Three. Three times. Uh, yep. Yep. Um, I was very tempted on taking my snowboard out and going down a hill by you a highway. Have. I didn't you over there by the, the old palace, right? There. Yeah. That's yeah. Perfect, that's that's dude. Right yeah. by Carlos O'Kelly's yeah, two yep. miles away. It's bro. not even very far. Yeah. And, and you know what? I could have, I really fucking you should have. I really could have, but you I was still can. like, there's still snow there. That's true. Let's go. You guys make fun of me enough at this point. If I did that, I would, 
Have God. a couple more non-alcoholic yeah, I, I would, drinks. I would yeah, love to be driving. To I'd love to be driving down Kellogg and just yeah. look over and see <laughs> Scotty going. <laughs> <laughs> Me too. Yeah, that'd be awesome. I'd get love off and it. come back around and oh, see yeah. it again. You yeah. know what? At least most people would think I was a child just because of That's my height. True. You know, that so maybe true. I can pull it off. Pull I was going to ask yeah. you during Halloween if you if you trick or treated. <laughs> <laughs> I'm fucking good. I think you should take advantage of the, of your height. I know I could, but I don't like a lot of candy. Well, um, well, you can give it to me. I'll use it in my van. Yeah, okay, <laughs> fine. <laughs> Great. Uh, but no, but I didn't want to. I decided, dude, When it, I just have a thing for, for when it's snowing its ass off and just sitting in the house oh, with a so fucking great. hire so with the fire. Great. Yeah, man, uh, I have my fireplace going, dude, man. Dude, it's just a whole nother Smoke fucking. Up. Smoking a little. It's so great. Smoking a little more. Playing some video games. <laughs> yeah. Smoking a little more. I, uh, oh, I did. I did. Uh, uh, I, I guess what do you call it? Relapse? <laughs> I don't know. I oh, had you had a drink. I did. I did have a, a quite a quite a few glasses of wine. Nice. Uh, well, quite a few <laughs> quite glasses a few. of wine. As one just tends a couple to do of bottles of wine. It's the cheat week, man. Yeah, you gotta, it, it's cool. the cheat it's weekend. True. So yeah. I did, but I had a really I, a really good time. How'd with you feel the next day? Oh man, it fucking hurt. It's the worst, isn't it? 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 It's terrible. Oh man, so wait till you get I'm, to be my age. I'm back on my non alcoholic stuff. It hurts a lot less. <laughs> yeah. Uh but there's Just that. Just drink through it. Um, yeah. But um <laughs> I, I I guess there was there's also I, I've been watching a lot of TikTok because I've been monitoring the video that uh, we're gonna bring up here in a little bit, but there's a video that's going around that's that's got quite a few views that I've always known. Uh, about it because I was an EMT at one one point in time in my life, hmm. um, but it's Theo Vaughn and he's asking this guy who is uh, some kind of investigator, um, and he and basically they're talking about how piece of shit cats are. Have you heard about this? <laughs> no. Okay, and and I've always known this. Uh, those of you out there who have cats as pets, uh -huh. just imagine this: if you die. In your house. Oh, yeah, they'll eat And your nobody yeah. knows yeah. that you're dead. Yeah, Cats yeah. will start to fucking eat you. And I yeah. don't mean like they yeah, will just dicks. they'll just go up and just kind of like start nibbling at you. No, they yeah. will fucking eat your face. Yep. Uh, I It was one of the worst calls I've ever had in my life uh, when I was volunteering because you have to go and have like hours. You have mm -hmm. to you have to get hours whenever you're on ride alongs and stuff. I don't even know what they're called anymore. But um, yeah, we actually ended up at a geriatrics house. Uh, and she had five cats. Oh, and they were uh, feasting her neck. That's where they went after. They Ugh. went after her neck, Ugh. and it was. But she had been dead for I think it was like maybe thirty six hours, something like that. And well, they had already started all eating. Right. Her. So this all of you guys who have funny. cats, enjoy that if you Yay. die. Yeah, uh, but I or did. Just yeah, have a partner. I did. Uh, first thing I wanted to do, I want to give a shout out. Um, today we had, we had a. I, I mentioned him a couple episodes ago. Um, but Jacob and Luke Hazen, uh, Jacob started listening to this show, I believe because of his, uh, his brother, uh, Luke, uh, Luke sadly actually passed away. Uh, and oh, today, shit. today would have actually been his 23rd birthday. So happy oh, heavenly fuck, birthday, man. birthday to Luke. Uh, I wanted to give young. him a shout out. Yeah. Way too young. Oh my God. Um, but yeah, so, uh, he wanted oh. to give a shout out. I think that constitutes it. I'll be happy to do that. Uh, but last but surely not least, uh, Steve, you had a video on TikTok that went a little bit nuclear. And uh, it, it was fucking yeah, great. It was good. That I was made my, uh, I made some week, I made week. some artwork. I don't know. I put it up on social media. Yeah, I thought it looked yeah. pretty fun. Cool. Uh, yeah. How's the t-shirts coming? Uh, I have uh, not got them done yet. There we go. Um, <laughs> I, uh, I don't know. Yeah, At Thanksgiving, fine. and I got drunk, very drunk on Thanksgiving. Yeah, uh, we ate dinner very late, so. Yeah. We were eating dinner during the halftime show where Dolly Parton was dressed as a Dallas Cowboys cheerleader. Yeah. <laughs> so eating dinner with a raging fucking hard on was hard to do. She's 77 um, years old. Dude. Yeah, I'd smash. Anyway, <laughs> it's... Uh, They're still huge. Yeah, I'd break that hip. <laughs> uh, <laughs> but it was, uh, it was an interesting day. Uh, I, I enjoyed it a lot. And then there was a 13-year-old girl that was there that's my uh, wife's... Uh, friend's daughter yeah and she is a tiktok fanatic oh yeah uh, when i showed her that we had over a million views on there she i've never seen someone more disappointed and upset in themselves. <laughs> <laughs> like, like, it was like the sweetest thing ever because i was just like oh this i guess this is cool i don't know and she's like 
what the fuck? I mean, dude, she <laughs> went ballistic. She could not understand how she's, dude, she's done stupid fucking dances for like the past 12 years. Oh, that's and great. Get, and she got 35 views, yeah. you know? No. And oh, yeah. so this was like, she was, she was heated. Dude. Oh, she was great. so mad. It was so amazing. You're the envy of every little girl. I know. I love it. Again. <laughs> well, yeah. you can let her know it actually hit 2 million I'm today. I'm going so. to. That's why I asked you to send me a screenshot of it. <laughs> I've already sent it to her. <laughs> oh. Oh, that's with the tagline "nana nana boo boo." <laughs> exactly, exactly, hundred percent. It's fucking crazy, man, how that yeah. works. And so now, and 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 uh, results, uh, we probably have a lot of listeners, new listeners on on this week's episode. Nice. Do, do not be discouraged. Yes, please. Yeah, it gets better. It does. It does. No, it doesn't. Oh, <laughs> this is Scotty. As it gets. This is Scotty opening up the show talking about depressing shit, and then he's like, <laughs> "So, how people. was your yes. week, man?" Oh, I just all those people who have cats. Yeah, it's a just fuck them. You That's, know what I'm saying? No, yeah, I agree. <laughs> just fuck them. Very the weird. Dogs don't do that. Did you know that? No, That's they how don't. they yeah. lay, they'll lay by your side yep. until somebody comes and finds they you. They will literally dead starve serious. To death. Yes. Yeah, there yep. was like a guy that was lost. Uh, he like died on a mountain trail, and his like fucking like Australian oh, shepherd. A couple weeks ago. A couple yeah. weeks ago. Yep. Yeah, that, I heard about that. They found the dog, and that's how they found the guy. The yeah. dog's nose and face was all fucked up because he was probably yeah. fighting off other animals trying to eat the guy. Yeah. And it was for, like, I don't know, a ridiculous amount of time, like weeks. So yep. Yep. Dogs are and awesome. He was Cats super, suck. Super emaciated. Too, yeah. So yeah. But, but anyways, the uh, dog, not the dead guy. Right. Maybe he was too. I don't know. <laughs> Probably. Yeah. He was fine. Yeah. Yeah. yeah just, yeah. just fine. Just uh, but what else? How, how was uh, how was the rest of your Thanksgiving down there, Steve? It was good. Yeah. It was good. It was uh yeah, Friday was a little uh, rough. Did you guys uh, It was a long day on the couch. I basically. was getting ready to ask because a lot of fucking people uh I, I saw videos all over social media of mm-hmm. Black Friday being mm-hmm. bullshit this year. I don't know if you guys yeah, saw that. I never that. really saw any huge deals or anything like that. No. I, mean, I looked online. I just never really saw any craziness, I, you know? But I remember when, like, you go to Walmart, Target, and Best Buy on Black Friday, there are people oh, camping yeah. out in the yeah. fucking parking yeah. lot. That's I think people you don't have to do it anymore. You right. Can you can get the same thing online. Uh, right. I get that. But what I'm saying, well, like, now. not only that, but I, I think inflation and stuff has that too. really killed it. Uh-huh. And then the other thing I was, I was like, thinking, or I saw, were, like, the Black Friday sales was just a new sign that said black friday on it and it was the exact same price yeah yeah so it's like yeah fuck you guys yeah so yeah yeah, it it, i don't i would never did that actually i never i never camped out or did anything ridiculous just blame it on covid yeah we we do with i like to blame it on the rain blame it on the rain snow we had snow i don't know who needs to hear this but it's time to take the plexiglass down (laughs) <laughs> okay like we're we're just it's time to do that now it's all of, not helping anymore. all the chinese food it restaurants never, in it town. never did but it's so, not doing it anymore here's the thing i would if i could yeah yeah but i screwed that shit in there real good like, like like you have no idea i used bolts from shit i didn't even know what they were from one's That's a hex nut screw one's a That's regular hilarious. phillips i mean but yeah, at the restaurant, they're still up. No shit. Yeah, because I can't take them down. That's fine. I tried to rip them out. It, yeah. That that didn't work. That's I mean, fucking Yeah, funny. so I, I until it. I get a Sawzall or something in there and fucking <laughs> yeah. trim them down, I think they're just going to stay there, man. As much, oh, I love it. As much as COVID really pissed me off, there are still some times today where I will. I still wish it was a thing so people would stay the fuck away from me. Yeah. <laughs> but uh, yeah. you should get yeah, T-shirts was... printed that say, I have COVID. <laughs> yeah. well, COVID yeah. positive. Yeah. There is a uh, mystery illness in China right now that's affecting children mostly, but oh. it's uh, it's scary. So maybe Yippee. we'll maybe we'll get it again. Well, good thing we're all over the age of thirty five. Yep. Yay! I just recently. Just recently. <laughs> 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 me too, bro. Yeah, me too. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, me too. Uh, uh, anything else you did, Steve? I heard you were gambling quite a bit. Oh, yeah, I uh, went and played poker right before this podcast, and I won $765. Hey, dude. All right. Yeah. Uh, At a poker room? Yeah. Yeah. Like at the casino? No, you know, yeah, no. it's not yeah. really get with yeah. me after the show. Yeah. I'll find yeah, out yeah, which yeah. one. Yeah, it's <laughs> not. Uh, I, go, I go to a couple of those myself. Not exactly <laughs> legal. Yeah, but, it's, uh, but yeah, it was fun. Wait, um, good job. Yeah, I don't do anything unless it's legal. Absolutely, <laughs> yeah, exactly, me too. Not I think everything I straight. do is illegal. Pretty much. I mean, when you slice <laughs> it, isn't nice sodomy it? still illegal in Kansas? Shut the fuck. No, it's Are you yeah, not. No, technically, yeah, yeah. No way. Yep. All That's right. True. 
Well, we're just a bunch bust of bust into JP's house and do a citizen's <laughs> arrest. <laughs> Put down that joint and come with me. Yeah. I heard you've been fucking dudes. Uh, yeah, I mean, you know, yeah, well, you I know do what? what I can. We'll validate that uh, later because uh, that may ha- may or may not have something to do with this week's draft. Oh wow! Yeah. Oh, all right, uh, look at that. Me, look at me segueing into oh, shit, even yeah. though I don't know what's coming. Right. Exactly. Dude, this happened last week too. I would just say things, and he's like, <laughs> "Did you read this?" I'm like, you know, I <laughs> never <laughs> read. No, I didn't read. Yeah, yeah that's so he still is. sends me copies. I know he sends them to me too. I don't ever. Look like at I them. said, that is my reminder to you guys. First of all, you smoke a lot of pot and might forget. I would never. Steve, man. on the other hand, sometimes I mean, he legitimately thought yesterday he was supposed yeah, to be it's here. True. That yeah. is true, and, that and is thought true. he was an hour and a half late. Yep, that's true. So that did happen. Hey, this I will is tell my you this: if you're ever an hour and a half late and I'm on the show, just forget it because I've already left. <laughs> He's yeah, already yeah, left. I, yeah, yeah, I kind of agree. There's no way. Yeah. Anyways, well, I'm glad. I hope everybody has had a great thanksgiving uh oh, yeah. it's my second favorite holiday uh now we get christmas baby that's the one that's the big one and oh, uh, i figured it was columbus day yeah <laughs> 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 no no nah, juneteenth yeah uh, well, yeah okay <laughs> anyways Touché. yeah right uh but no we do have an excellent show to go over uh we're gonna get uh kick this thing off already with the headlines um i got more comments of talking shit about the detroit lions all week I fucking told you. I told you. I fucking told you. And I knew it. And I told you. Yeah. Do you need me to say this anymore? I believe you did say, well, remember we talked about Jared being Jared Goffel last yes, week? I did. Yep. What I exactly happened uh, over this last uh, he week? He lived up to his name. Fucking did, didn't he? Yeah, it was bad. Sure did. Was I, bad. I don't think I've seen him play worse. It was fucking horrible. So too. for so what it's bad. worth, the only direction Jared is up. Or, yeah. I mean, so. Yeah. Uh, there's that. Uh, and I did not like it that it was against the fucking Packers. That, that makes me yeah, more angry. I 100% so, agree. I hate the fucking Yeah. Game. Yep. Uh, but I still have hope. I still, I mean, I think the upcoming week we play the Saints in New Orleans. Uh, if they have a turnaround game, I will still have confidence. Uh, but if they go the following week and beat Dallas and Dallas, then I'll say, Okay, we're back on track. But it all has a lot to do with how Jared performs. So mm-hmm. don't be golfful, golfful. Yeah, um, there's golfful, that. you dick. You dick. I'll bet you any amount of money you want to bet they don't beat the Cowboys. Oh, I know I don't. Yeah, like that. I, uh, I don't think they'll beat the I Cowboys. I think it's going to be a good game, and I'm going to bet the over on it. Yeah. Uh, I, don't, I, I don't know about that either. I don't know about no, that either. I think I'm going to bet the over on it just because I think the Cowboys are going to fucking mow them down okay. so bad that they'll yeah. get there, the over on it. Okay, own. there you and go. And if you want to talk about a team that will not fucking stop beating your ass into the ground. That's true. Dallas, Dallas, Dallas. They, 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 don't, they don't back off. Yeah, yeah, they, they do not back off. Up by 35 and like, yep, oh, fucking, pick yeah. six. Yep. Why the yep. fuck not? Yep. You know what I'm saying? Yep. Mm-hmm. Uh, But, yeah, so we also uh, ended up having uh, the Pittsburgh Steelers get their very first Mm -hmm. win after Mm -hmm. firing Matt Canada. A lot of Pittsburgh Steelers fans are happy. But more shockingly, the Pittsburgh Steelers also had uh, over 400 yards of total offense scored. Uh, So, hey, maybe they got a fucking point. And as much as I dislike Pittsburgh Steelers fans, congratulations. Uh, That's obviously a huge relief. Mm -hmm. Good for you guys. Mm -hmm. But if you guys win your fucking division and get a good seat in the playoffs, I don't believe it. But uh, it's probably going to happen. I do want to give your Denver Broncos a shout out. You guys started the season one and five. (laughs) Huh? <laughs> and you have one, I believe it's five straight. <laughs> yeah, it's, yeah. No, they've been killing it, man. Yeah. They really have. Or like you're yeah, six and five. It. I don't even know. Yeah, but six yeah. and five. Six and five. Uh-huh. That's yeah, they're, uh, now they're pretty in solid, a, dog. They're in playoff hunt. Yeah. yeah we're going to make the playoffs. We're yeah. going to. That, that would be. I, if you told me at the beginning of the year we were going to make the playoffs, I'd have fucking told you to get fucked. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I mean, there's no That's way. Amazing. Yeah. That's like, like, uh, awesome. It's like, what the fuck happened to Russell Wilson? All of a sudden, he seems competent. I don't know, man. I don't either. But hey. Know. He's still not worth what we paid for him. <laughs> That's definitely fucking true. Uh, Unless we win the Super Bowl this year. That's still not going to happen. Then it's worth it. It's not going to happen. I, ag- I agree. Yeah. But uh-huh. you dude, know Denver's probably plus $20 billion <clears throat> to win the Super Bowl. Yeah, dude. Just throw a $20 bet down. <laughs> I, just should probably, I should probably bet 20 on bucks, it. 20 bucks. It pays $250,000. Yeah, exactly. But anyway. 
Uh, moving on, we had uh, we had Ludacris make an appearance. Yeah, what <laughs> the <laughs> fuck was that? Uh, Who okayed that? He was like, you no know, idea. it would be a great idea. And somebody else went, you know, I like it. I like it. Let's do it. And then they called Ludacris. And they'd have to talk him into fucking doing it. I loved it. I loved it, too. Yeah, let's have him drop from the rafters. And <laughs> yeah. Not, like, sing a normal song. No. no let's no. sing Move, Bitch, yeah, Get Out get the Way. Out oh, obviously, the Perfect. bitch was in the way, and she needed to move. <laughs> yeah. yeah. So and you got to yeah. tell her, in what better way? I love it. So, uh, would you ever do that? Would you ever, like, repel from the rafters? Fuck yeah. I wish I could get famous enough to have them want me to repel exactly. from the rafters. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, but, that makes more but sense. But no, I would not because I do not like yeah. heights. Yeah, I fig- I, I was That was kind of the question. Anybody yeah. scared of I think I, I would do have... do not like heights. I, I'm terrified of flying, but I'm not scared of heights. I would definitely repel from the rafters no problem. I, I love the, those fucking... On your snowboard. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe. Doing tricks. I yeah. like it. I would definitely, I like I would definitely do it. Oh, hey, How you know many what? 720s can you do on that snowboard? I've never pulled a 720. Uh, what have you pulled? Uh, I've pulled Besides a five. Besides your muscles. I've pulled a five. Two fours oh. and a six. All right. I've pulled a five. <laughs> But I, but that's not my that's not my thing. I don't want to so go. You're not a. You don't go to the little park. I, I don't go to the park. Oh, I, okay. I I I go all over the mountain, and the steeper and the faster I can go, the better. Really? That's why that is a race. God, road. I wish he would hit a tree. I know. Oh, that's just once, man. Yeah. It's just a matter of time. Yeah, and I like. I mean, no bullshit. My favorite like runs to go on on the mountain we go to. I have to hike, and it takes me about thirty minutes to get up there from the lift because I have to hike to it because no. Nobody builds. Yeah, you just and his little it. lungs don't have as much oxygen either, so he's like right. really huffing and <laughs> puffing. I'm in the lungs. I'm in the best shape of my life when I get back from that fucking oh, trip. Yeah. Though I oh, guarantee yeah. it. Yeah. Uh, anyways, uh, moving on. Um, the Philadelphia Eagles beat the uh, Buffalo wow. Bills. What yeah, a crazy was, comeback that was. There were some that egregious was. calls that may or may not have been missed on uh, yeah. during that game. Yeah. Yeah. The, I think Josh Allen had his fucking jersey damn near ripped off. Oh, yeah, and they didn't call it. Didn't I call saw it. that. Yeah, yeah. that should have yeah. been a horse collar. Yeah. Uh, there was a lot of yeah. shit like that throughout that whole entire game. And I think one of the players made a really fucking good point. It's not that they make mistakes. They're just not being held accountable for making them. The referees aren't. Well, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. yeah, that's true. That's very because true. Because they Something have a script to, to follow. Yeah, exactly. No. All right, Derek. Uh, yeah, no kidding. Calm down. No, but, like, oh, shit. no bullshit. It it just looks fucking sketchy as hell whenever shit like that happens. Like I, I really dislike when games are decided by <clears throat> penalty flags and officials. Yeah. Uh, but I when agree. you miss a blatantly obvious one, then I think the referee should get docked or something. Yep. Right? Yeah. We should yeah. circumcise yeah. them on the field. Yep. The best part no of No more docking for them. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> yeah. Uh, the best part of this particular game was actually the after. Uh, there was a video that also went around that was fucking hilarious, and it was a little kid. He had to have been maybe five or six years old, went to go shake the hands of a Buffalo Bills fan, and the Buffalo Bills fan, seeing a kid who was in a Philadelphia jersey, thought, I'm going to be a good person, reached his hand out to shake his hand, and before he could touch his hand, the little kid flipped him oh, off. <laughs> of course he did, because he's from Philly. And it's fine. Yeah. Yeah. Fucking assholes, <laughs> dude. That's I awesome. I love that. That's that like, is awesome. I don't know if I'm mad or I love that kid. Oh, it right. was great. I dude. don't know, but he obviously didn't know who that kid was. Right. So, ah. That's awesome. Ah, but you know what? That's awesome. Oh, it's great. It's great for you know. Could you imagine media. being that kid's dad? Would you be proud or pissed? Oh, proud as fuck. <laughs> 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 it couldn't be proud or son. Let's go get some ice cream. Yeah, that'd, be, that'd be pretty good shit. Makes yeah. sense if you're a Philly fan. Exactly. Uh, moving on to the next one. Uh, mm-hmm. I'm going to skip over that Yay. last one, and we'll go to the next one. Uh, there was a, uh, a kid who's also making his rounds on social oh, media. Oh, fuck. This is yeah. so In blackface stupid. even, right? No. But it was that, black and red face. There you go. It was well, the colors this, of his team. This is he why. I don't think he woke up in the morning and was like, Mom, guess what I'm going to do tonight? <laughs> <laughs> Holy fuck. I'm going to make a, uh, I'm gonna make a statement. <laughs> See, right. I'm going to make a, I'm a I five-year-old like, making a statement. Yeah, I feel like that is how it went. So and I feel like he probably stupid, watched uh, Tropic Thunder the night before. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. There you go exactly. You go. Yours is getting all tangled yeah, up. Yeah, man, I'm I, getting I, stuck. I, there dude. you go. I got you. You're good. Uh, but no, the biggest thing is is the uh, the. Here's the deal. 
They obviously targeted this kid. 100%. Yeah, 100%. Dude, 100%. His, his face was red on one side, split, and black on the other for Chiefs yep. colors. Yep. And they only took a shot that uh, black side. Exactly. <laughs> yeah. The yep. half that's yep. black. And you're just uh, like, oh, shit. shit. <laughs> so, the, so the piece of shit that, that posted about it and, and got this thing started doubled down and said, now that I know that the other side was red, I would say that's even worse. So I'm like for what, like what Native Americans. Yeah, right. I guess. Right. Yeah, I guess. You. I don't know. It I'm was so sick and tired yeah. of this. Yeah. In fact, why I, can't we just find that person and beat the, the fuck, fuck out, out of them? Right. I, I say we take all the. Know? I say we take all the Indians and put them on their own land. <laughs> <laughs> well, we're gonna a <laughs> little late right. for that. <laughs> Uh, but no, I, I, this is, and I think the kid has a case, but there's already rumors talking about that he will actually fucking, his family is going to sue because Dude, of all of the at, bad press. If you look at Nick Sandman or Sandman, whatever the fuck his sure. name was, uh, what did he, he sued for 265 million, I believe, I'll go uh, CNN, because when the, when the full video came out, they were like, oh, fuck. Fuck. <laughs> he yeah. was actually doing the right thing. The other guy's the dick. Yeah. And they, they fucking tried to ruin his life. Yeah. I mean, they literally tried to ruin his and life. And I think that that's what needs and to it's happen. Just that, it's just that fucking angry. I don't know that it's woke mob. It's just the angry mob shit, the, that knee-jerk reaction shit yes. of not having the full story and just reacting. And then you react so much that you it's hard for people to... to to admit that they're wrong to humble themselves yeah. and go you know what i i didn't have all the info that was kind of dumb yeah Sorry. no i think that you're just exactly doesn't right. happen anymore i think it you're just exactly right yeah but they the just, thing they is just double down with it the thing is that probably more than anything though is that people like us talk about it on shows like people yeah, have podcasts it's true it gets yeah. more and more clicks people more get oh. like look for that shit Dude, and that's why i had i was gonna tell you uh when i was at the poker game the kid that was dealing the poker game yeah he goes, was Dude. he in blackface? Yeah. Oh. Of course. Well, of course. Only, uh, I was going to say, yeah, if he only, wasn't, that's, that's not a very I'll legitimate go. game. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Uh, <laughs> he talked with a weird accent, too. He's like, hey, Miss Don, what can we get for you over here? <laughs> hey. <laughs> But it was, uh, he goes, he goes, dude, I didn't know you were on the Laughing on the Sidelines podcast. <laughs> I was like, what the fuck? And he goes, yeah, it was like a suggested thing on TikTok. I saw it the other day. It was fucking hilarious. I was like, holy shit, that show has listeners. Oh, yeah, I dude. Like, I didn't really know that. I, yeah. thought, I thought we were just kind of, you know, fucking I was at, yeah, I was I at bowling a couple of weeks ago. Yeah. And one of the guys, I, I mean, that's on the league, he walked by me. And as he's walking by me, he's like, Love the podcast. Yeah, that's <laughs> fucking good. Weird. Glad it's, to hear it. It's very fucking weird. And it gets worse. It gets worse and worse and worse. Uh, you'll you'll just go to bars. Yeah. And, and, but, and I it, love it. Well, you'll go to bars. You it's go to restaurants. Great. I swear to God, there was one time I was eating dinner with my wife. Yeah. And I just kept, I had no idea. I kept getting mean mugged. Oh, by nice. by by a by a like a younger kid. He's probably twenty three, twenty four, something yeah. like that. Yeah, well, and he like, was he, he, he was with a, he was with his girlfriend or something like that, and he just staring at me, just fucking staring. And I'd catch eyes with him, and he'd look away real quick. Yeah, and it turns out like finally we're getting ready to leave. He comes up to me, and he was like, "Are you Scotty from Laughing on the Sidelines?" Nice. And I'm like, "I'm like yes." And he and then it all made sense. And I was like, "Ah, damn, dude, I thought you were gonna follow me on my fucking car." That story would have been way better if he <laughs> signed his did, girlfriend's right. tits. <laughs> that would have been. been awesome uh, that yeah, been yeah. awesome yeah you know just eating in carabas and yeah signing tits yeah that's, that's awesome that's, that's a, what i do that's what <laughs> i do i eat carabas tuesday. and i sign tits that is a normal tuesday so uh back to the actual uh topic at hand my question was going to be um mm -hmm. do you think there's any particular possibility p possibility that we could get robert downey jr to go to a chiefs game and be the character from tropic thunder <laughs> <laughs> Because he did it, such a good job. Maybe back in the day when he was on all the drugs. <laughs> yeah. Probably I, I, so. But now I don't know. I watched an interview about that movie with yes. him. And he goes, somebody said, oh, I think it was Joe Rogan. And he, yeah, goes, Rogan. he goes, he goes, you couldn't make that movie today. And he goes, you can make that movie today. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> and then he goes, he goes, he goes. I think he said, how the fuck did you get out of that one? And then he goes, Ben Stiller took it all. <laughs> I was like, holy fuck, he did when he came Happy Jack or whatever the fuck it was. Oh, Jesus, yeah. that's yeah. fucking <laughs> Never great. go full retard. Yeah. I, was like, oh, <laughs> I was so great. Dude. Uh, but anyways, everybody out there, lighten the fuck up. I'm getting tired of this shit. I'm just a kid having fun at a game.
And yeah, uh, that was a little fucked up. Really like, that kid has up. no. He, the kid's like a super fan. You or know whatever. what? And, I mean, he doesn't know. And it's I'll make the I'll, parents. I'll fault make. I'll make the bet. You know what? No, yeah, those, those parents raised like, a little yeah. racist. No, yeah. and that's actually. I think that's what's going to be the thing. Is now I bet you that kid had absolutely no idea what racism was, and now we're teaching it to him, and now it becomes a thing. I think if you completely take it out of the equation altogether at a young age, oh, nobody yeah. would know. Yeah, he wouldn't have any idea. You would have no. none. But now we're bringing yeah. it up all the time. I, I just think, found out about it too weeks ago yeah. i didn't know what racism <laughs> was i was just banging black chicks no bullshit i didn't find out until college oh we've talked about it on the show i had yeah. no idea no what I, racism I, was. I know i was the same way because i grew it's up in a pretty ridiculous. prominently black neighborhood yeah anyway. had i've had a, more than one black like yeah i, I don't it's yeah i don't know i i feel yeah. like there's there's i was I, I felt like i was like slow going like growing up or whatever because yeah. i just didn't I don't know, man. I we just, just didn't, didn't get we just, yeah, we, just we weren't get taught it. with that. We, yeah, we were never you know taught I mean? that. Yeah, so that's yeah. that's kind of my point. Yeah. But anyways, uh, moving on. Uh, somebody else who uh, is trying they're trying to cancel. Uh, Matt Rife had his uh, <laughs> special on Netflix uh, over the last week. There are several comics that said that Matt Rife will be the first comedian to get a special and actually do work. It's <laughs> 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 fucking rolling. <laughs> Uh, uh, yeah. I anyway. did, okay, did all of us watch the special? Did, of course. Of course we did. We did. Uh I I will say it's not his best material. I, I, I think I did not watch. I, I, I don't I don't think it's his best. Uh, but I love Matt Rife. I think he's great. I the only comedian excellent. that I will watch is Shane Gillis. Okay, well that's no. that's fine. Uh you uh, and him need to have the fucking I was hoping there. that they would love cancel Matt Rife. And that he would just fall onto hard times <laughs> and just just fucking not care about his life anymore. It's, and then I would try to meet him. <laughs> yeah. So yeah, it, it'll be like the end of fucking dodgeball. Yes. He's just all yeah. fat in front of the and TV. I'd still fuck him. And I didn't. I, I didn't. I didn't even dive into whatever joke it was. I don't care. But he said that because of his special, there was a joke that a lot of people got offended by, and so he made a link to an apology mm-hmm. about that but, particular yep, joke. That was hilarious. And it sent him to a website that sells helmets for special needs kids i think that was the best part of his Dude, special that's amazing. yeah <laughs> probably that's amazing yeah. it was great i think yeah. that's probably the best part so and i think that I, I i'm hoping i'm hoping that all those people that get really offended really really quickly they just start sucking it up and just mm. just stop watching shit you don't want to watch yeah i agree 100%. why do you go to a, why do you watch a comedy show why and, does everything have to fucking why do you have to let everybody know that you're offended i agree I like agree. Just be offended and just go, go on. It's the fucking same. go away. It's the same. You know what I mean? Oh my god! You know how many people have left comments on the post? I feel like I feel like there's. I feel like people need sympathy. Like I feel like that's what it is. I feel like fuck. You I ain't getting like it from people, me. Sorry. I feel like people want just just some compassion. You know what I mean? Like I feel like people are just. Maybe if they feel wronged or something like that, they just want somebody to acknowledge it. Listen, I think that's what it is. I don't know. Listen, I will tell you firsthand, off off camera when we're not doing a fucking comedy show. Oh, you I'm, use racist words I'm probably all the time. one of the most empathetic pers- people about <laughs> anything. Anything, really. But during a comedy show, if you turn on a fucking comedy show and mm-hmm. you are just waiting to get like fucking offended about something, Stop doing that to yourself. Yeah, it is it's going like, to happen. You know, like when Kramer did stand up. That was, <laughs> yeah. You know, I, but, I know. what are you bitching about? Uh, but it's, they but they do it and they're just on <laughs> pins and needles on the edge of their seat just waiting there to get is, pissed I, off I, about I, something. In Los Angeles, I have 100% firsthand experienced it where people come to comedy shows to be offended, to let you know that they're offended about what you're saying. Jesus, you it, had... It's, and it's other fucking comics. That's the problem. That's a bad. lot of times it's like open mics and shit, and it's the other fucking comics. Ah, that's bad. That's the worst piece of shit on planet. That is. Dude. No, like it's bad. You almost got into a... You had a, you had a separate an altercation between a lesbian and a... That is show. true. Yeah. That is true. And then I told the lesbians to just calm down <laughs> and go smash their vaginas <laughs> together. <laughs> And then she was like, that's not how it works. And I'm like, don't ruin my fucking dream. Get out of here. It was great. It was great. That was on video, too. It was, was yeah. yeah I, that got a lot of views. I, I got the video on that somewhere. But, yeah. yeah. Uh, anyways, anything else you guys want to talk about about the sports that happened or anything else that's happened over the last week? I don't think so. I don't either. It, like, I, it was all football, turkey, and all that stuff. Yeah. Anybody watch the Macy's Day Parade? Nope. Fuck Man, no. For the first time ever, I didn't. Are you fucking yeah, lying? Bad. No, I usually my mom used to make us, you oh, know, that was kind wow. of a thing. So, 
Mm. I don't know. I liked it. Whatever. Oh my Fuck off. goodness. <laughs> anyway. Uh all right, Steve. That's uh interesting. Did you tell that to your therapist this week? Uh, I did not go today. I was supposed to go today and I went and picked up my truck instead. Were you gonna see Brennan or Maddie? Uh the uh, that one. And I was gonna uh then <laughs> I was, I don't I don't know if I'm still good to go with old Bren. <laughs> old Bren boy. I think that's that's Let's that, see time's, I don't that think, time's passed. Uh, yeah, I don't that I don't think I have any has, dates. The ship has sailed. Ship has sailed. Do not have any dates left with him i thought i uh, might i thought it might be the eighth but that's just letting me know that's the first day of hanukkah you fucking you fucking so, scared him away yeah i think so eh, it's uh, all right. he's, shocked. he is now barista at starbucks <laughs> yeah. yeah yeah it's well he's <laughs> he's quit his career poor yeah, brennan it's, ah, anyway well, well anyways yeah. good luck to you out there brennan hope yeah. you're doing okay yeah uh, but anyways, that is headlines for this week. Now we get to move on to the fun parts of the show and everybody actually comes to listen to the show about. I kind of want to go back now so I can just call him Bryn Bryn the whole time <laughs> <laughs> and just see how he reacks. That'd be so fun. All uh, right. Anyway, Whatever sorry. happens, if you do go back, please get that on uh, video and yes, send it to us. I appreciate 100 that. 100 fucking percent. I want to see this guy. Uh, but anyways, <laughs> now we get to move on to the fun stuff. We get to kick the show off with the uh, Never Have I Ever segment yeah. of this show. Thank you, all of you guys who participate in month day fun day every mm -hmm. single monday we share a post where you guys can make your suggestions for every single episode um and this week we had some doozies i loved every minute of it uh all of on all of our uh, socials twitter instagram and facebook uh laughing on the sidelines if you have any trouble uh, finding it then you have some serious issues uh but anyways uh we're gonna kick this off with never have i ever this one comes in from facebook this is derek dupont he wants to know. What a stupid first name. <laughs> 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 Kill yourself. <laughs> oh, goodness Go gracious. Go yourself, man. He even spells it the same. I'm yeah. actually kind of crazy. Yeah. Uh, anyways, uh, he wants to know, uh, never have I ever made faces at a little kid when their parents aren't looking. I've done it while their parents are looking. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I've done that. Yeah, yeah for yeah. sure. Oh, I'll be done. I, uh, as, as a child, I right. would ride in the back of a station wagon facing backwards <laughs> and flip people off the whole, <laughs> the whole fucking time. And I did not discriminate on whether it was no. a child or an adult. Doesn't Everybody matter. got it. Yeah. yeah. But uh, yeah, I don't know. <laughs> you I think I talk my little sister to moon and people. <laughs> that was great. <laughs> now people go to jail for child oh, pornography. Yeah. Oh, that's God. Great. Yeah, that's great. Uh, yeah. <laughs> There's I, three I never, people in prison still. I never have. I just try to avoid all of the kids. Children in general. Yeah, just yeah. Yeah. I, dude, I like yeah. kids. I always make stupid This guy doesn't talk like talking to, to people that can look him in the eyes. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like, I feel like me, and, me and kids are on the same mental level. That's, that's why I think I'd I'm, go yeah. Yeah, I go right in for it. That's true. All right, uh, next one uh, is coming in from Connor Reeves. He wants to know, right. never have I ever found... Oh. oh, shit. Never have I ever found my parents' home porno video. Well, wow. no, but it's not from a lack of looking. <laughs> yeah, I tried. <laughs> I promise you that. Like, I searched high and low for that fucking thing. I'm sure it's got to be there somewhere, but I couldn't find it. Oh, oh man. Yeah. Lord. Could Connor just send his parents? <laughs> right. I was just getting ready to say, does here? he have a copy that'd of his fine. parents' home video? I mean, that'd be fine. It's not weird for us. but Yeah, that's true. But the uh, that would be weird, dude. Your mom was taking that dick like a champion. Yeah, yeah. Uh, uh, credit to Tom Segura on on his special, but holy fuck, it was absolutely and it's totally one hundred percent true. If you think that your mom is just a very prude individual lady, <laughs> she has taken loads in the face. Yeah, uh, yeah. over all and over. over. Her tits. That's so fucking. Bad. Yeah. If it's something you would do, it's something they would do yep. too. Yep. So, uh, but no, I thankfully have never found my parents' porno videos. I've I found my dad's stash. If oh, nice. Yeah, of other go. people fucking, but you yeah, know, it. Uh, That's good. Yeah, it's you know whatever at, at a young age. I Maybe. like it. Yeah. Oh, have, have, yes. Uh, it's $127 on my first period Carolina bet. Jesus Look at Christ. you go. Look at the you hurricanes go. won the first period. You done? Yep. Okay. Uh, next one comes in from Facebook. This is Craig Remington. He wants to know, never have I ever sat on the toilet so long my legs fell asleep. Dude, I do that three times a fucking day. <laughs> yeah. Literally, sometimes I just have to get up and lay down for the blood to go back. Like, you know how you walk like fucking Frankenstein just to get to somewhere to lay down? 
Yeah, that's every day for me. When you're married, that's the only time you get to have peace oh, and it's quiet. It's so peaceful. It's yeah. so peaceful. That's a that's, so a that's a that's like a room in the house you're allowed to go into with a lock on it and lock yep. that son of a bitch yep. out. For sure. Yes, for you sure. go in there and sit down. I've done it too. I've sat on yeah. the floor as well. Uh, oh, or if yeah. you, like, you really do that, you like if you guys are the only two home when you go into the bathroom, you shut and lock the door. Yeah, one hundred percent. That's so. Yeah, weird. what if you decide yeah. to rub one out? That's and so that's weird. the other thing you don't. What if your legs are too? Have your legs ever been too asleep? To, you're like, I don't know if I, can, I don't know if I can rub this thing out fast enough, or if I'm gonna get like blood clots. You know? Oh, nice. Yeah, yeah, it's bad. It's like you're just fucking searching through porn. Like, nope, nope, nope. <laughs> Fuck, hurry up! My legs are fucking leaving me. It's all right. You just go to your favorites. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> yeah. I guess that's the difference between straight people and and what gay people. I, I don't even shut the door. <laughs> Why? Oh my! Like, why would you ever? I, I, we're the only two home. I don't. Thought, I don't even shut the door. Neither does he most of the really? time. In almost every relationship I've been in. Yeah, I know. And there have been plenty. <laughs> <laughs> no, <laughs> I I too it. many. Really, I that's don't awesome. Think, I don't necessarily think that's a gay or straight thing. Uh, I think the main reason why I think I do it is because uh, me and my wife have an understanding with each other, and that is neither of us want to uh, know that the other person is taking a shit. I've yeah, got a, I've got a go. video on my phone right now of my ex taking a shit that's with uh, a weird. mud mask on, and I was making fun of him because he was wearing his yeah yeah I don't know weird wow that wasn't a mud mask <laughs> no, <laughs> not after I got done with it. <laughs> <laughs> what color that was, was very the mud. organic? Yeah, yeah. Jeez, yeah. oh, uh, but no, yeah. I've definitely sat on the toilet long enough to to make my legs fall asleep. Absolutely, I have. Yeah, yeah. God, for sure. Yeah, I love it. That's right. Is uh, it weird that I watched that video quite a bit? <laughs> yes, that's, that's his rub. That's his rub one out video. That's yeah. his favorite okay. right there. I love it. Uh, next one. This one comes in from Instagram. This is Dev Dev. Uh, he wants to know Dev, old Dev Dev. Dev, Dev. Yeah, old Dev Long Dev. time no hear. Yeah. Yep. He wants to know. Never have I ever got so drunk that you don't know where you are. What's happened many times? I was gonna say is that kind of yeah. I can't you're not, even. You're not count. even drinking if that doesn't. Fuck right. Happen. You're not doing it right. I can yeah. honestly say I have never got so drunk. And I woke up, and I didn't know where I am. Oh, that's happened to me so many times. Yeah. I have, however, got so drunk and woke up someplace and wondered how I got there. Okay. That is true. Yes. Yeah. That's 100%. more I've done of both. the mystery. 100%. Yeah. yeah. It, it's, it's, I know where 100%. I'm at, but I've never, like, like gotten so fucked up. I was in another goddamn state or some shit like that. Right. I just, yeah. I just don't know how I traveled, uh, <laughs> home yeah that's that's the there. only thing <laughs> i've woken up in ditches on the side of the road in my car holy when shit! when i was in bro. high school uh out in, Ro out in rose hill kansas oh, there's yeah. just dirt roads nobody ever fucking travels that's and true so yeah, i have woke yeah. up out in the country more than once in my car we're we're <laughs> we're we're country fuck people. like i just get fucking tired of looking and yeah. i'm like fuck it i'm gonna pull over and go to sleep did you ever <laughs> did you ever booze cruise when you were and oh younger? hell yeah! No, yeah, sure. oh, you mean like right around in yeah, drink, it's like dirt road, yeah, driving. dirt road oh, driving constantly. Yeah. Okay, yeah, I just want to make sure. sure. Dude, so my yeah. grand, I moved when I right after high school, I moved to my and moved in with my grandma, and she lives in a place called Seneca, Kansas. It's no my, right where it's at. Okay, yeah, so, dude. That's what you do on a Saturday night. One hundred percent. Drag Main ever, Street kids and do you like, drink. Yeah, that's what 100%. you do. Yeah. Do kids do keg parties anymore, like in fields? I don't, I don't think know. it's cool to drink as much anymore. No, they're Fucking woke. Nerds. No bullshit. I was bruise cruising yeah. with my best friend at the time, and we yeah. were trying to impress uh, impress a couple of girls, uh, <laughs> and, and and they were in my truck. Yeah. We were going sixty miles an hour down a dirt road, and <laughs> oh, he shit. thought it would be a really good idea to open the passenger door of my truck and stand on the uh, oh, the running board no. that's oh, down there. Shit. That is not a good idea. Yeah, he fell out going sixty. Oh, oh shit! I, no, good. no bullshit. I have a picture of him to where he fell out. He he ripped off his shirt and oh. he had rock. God. All the way up oh, his yeah. side, and uh, I did that. I I, I wasn't yeah. not going sixty miles an hour. This was maybe he was going maybe fucking ten mile an hour, but I was sitting on the hood of my friend's Monte Carlo, and I went Holy to jump shit. off. I went to jump off, and I was just going to be like, "Hey, I'll see you later." Yeah. And when I jumped off, you know, dumbass me, 
didn't run with it. I planted. And <laughs> oh, no. I, dude, oh, no. My mom picked rocks out of my fucking back for an hour and a half. I still have scars from oh, my Oh, shit. no. It's yeah. no, yeah, it's it's crazy. no bullshit. No, it, it's crazy. We laugh about it now, but at Jesus, the, 60 miles an hour. Yeah. I thought 10 was bad. Yeah, it, it, it was. Fuck. But, and it was weird because all of a sudden it was dead silent. We're, I mean, obviously you oh. got the radio cranked up. You're listening oh, yeah. to music yeah. and everybody's screaming. And all of a sudden. Did you go back cat, for him? Oh, I slammed on the brakes. Oh. It turns See, out I just he kept slid going. past the truck. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, I had no idea. Luckily, luckily, he he said I missed running him over. Barely. Oh, I bet. Oh, yeah, because he got oh, he got wow, caught. He dude. put his fucking oh, leg out. Yeah, God. and that's what pulled him down. But yeah, it, he's uh, he's still alive. Uh, wow. But you know what? You know, I bet he's not doing that anymore. Actually, Steve, you'll understand this. He's also an eleven Bravo uh, for oh, the army. So, that hey, makes all the sense is. in the fucking world, yeah, right there. there it yeah. is. He's probably done that more <laughs> than once now. Yeah. It's one of my favorite characters yep. in the world. He took all of his money after he get back from basic and he actually took a Walmart shopping cart and turned it into like a fucking motorized golf cart. Holy shit, that's amazing. <laughs> this guy has his priorities straight. 100%. I love it. Oh God. I love you, Ben Morgan. Okay. Right. Sorry, that was a whole bunch of tangents we just went off of. Uh, but yes, I, I definitely, I'd never have gotten so drunk I didn't know where I was. Right. All right. Yeah. yeah. Everybody? Okay. Yep. Uh, next go. one. Oh, this is actually the last one. This is uh, coming in from Twitter. This is from Trenton Kennedy. He wants to know Never have I ever peed your name in the snow. I have, but it was. Uh, it was in Trenton's mom's handwriting. <laughs> <laughs> well, all righty then. Uh, oh, we went cursive. Wow. <laughs> yeah, oh, yeah. Oh, uh, calligraphy. Oh, nice. Yeah. I have. Uh, I don't think I have. I mean, I pissed. Oh, in the I snow. for sure I have. Pissed. On Thursday, I pissed in the snow. Are you ton. fucking? Ki- but, That's uh, like something every kid I think has done. Yeah, I probably, probably not. I probably have. I've drawn I pictures. Probably. Yeah, yeah I, I did. Uh, Starry, starry night. <laughs> one time uh fan goes so yeah. his ear back on he was so impressed yeah, you yeah. Do, you, yeah. <laughs> no you, i love that That's you do awesome. your initials you you always have to draw a penis like in yeah, some point in your life sure. right yeah, yeah. uh <laughs> yeah you always have to draw a penis whenever you're uh whenever you're young and stupid and you think it's funny uh there's an embankment <laughs> there's an embankment over by my high school and it's a huge hill it's it's huge and so when it snowed enough uh inches of snow we all went out there and walked a giant dick in the snow in my front nice. dude, in my That's front badass. yard in my front yard right now <laughs> i came out the other day to smoke a cigarette on saturday and it was toward the end of the snow and my roommate walks in and she she's inside for a couple minutes and she comes back out and she's like hey have you seen aaron and I'm like, no. She's like, he was right behind me. So we walk around the other side of the house, and he is making a dick in the snow Dude. in footprints. It's still there right now. I'll take a picture if of it when I get home. If it was your neighbors that did that as a gay guy, I think that's a hate crime. <laughs> or an invitation. Yeah, that's yeah, true. That. That's awesome. Oh, that's so great. I love yes. it. Got to see that glass half full. Yeah, exactly. Oh, man. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, that is never have I ever uh, for this week. Now we get to move on to JP's favorite part of Love every it. single episode. Yep. This is called That's Where I Draw the Line. Uh, kick this bad boy off from Twitter. This is uh, coming in from Cody Adkinson. Hell yeah. He wants to know, what is the earliest time you will wake up to travel somewhere to beat the traffic? 4 a.m. Ooh. Yep. 4 a.m.? 4 a.m. Man. That is a very s- specific, specific the fucking reason, answer, so man. So I know how long it takes me to get to Tunica, and I have gigs in Tunica every once in a while, and that's usually great gambling earliest. town. Yeah, it is. It's badass. Yeah. Uh, they have a theater show there. Uh, for, I think it's a bon- Bonkers Comedy Club. Fuck, I can't remember, but it's in a casino, and that's what I do. I get up at four a.m. and I leave, and I'm always there like a couple hours before the mm. show. So it's always amazing. But four a.m. is about the earliest I'm doing it. I um I did something for the very first time last year. Um, Grew two inches. <laughs> <laughs> no dog, I haven't uh, grown since middle school, man. Uh, okay. Um, but no, uh, we actually decided because it's an eight-hour trip to Angel Fire, New Mexico. Yeah. Right. Yep. Yep. We decided to actually leave at eight o'clock at night and Ooh, drive through the night. Fuck that. And I'm we scared. ended up getting there and it was I want to say I mean god damn it it was early in the morning. Well yeah. But there wasn't a fucking soul on the road. 
So yeah, I don't the know. The only man. thing just, you got to look out asleep. for are deer, yeah, and, and that's sleep. it. Deer and sleep. Deer is not no because we alternated drivers, and so yeah. when that wasn't the problem, it was just deer. You just got to keep your eyes open for fucking deer. But once you get into Oklahoma, New Mexico, it's really not that bad. Yeah, so yeah, yeah so I, that's what I'd say. The earliest is is the night before. Okay, that's okay. me. How about so you? I'm closer to Steve. I say three a.m. Yeah. First of all, traveling as much as I have. Yep. I love to be on the road at night. Yeah. Yeah. That, that early yeah. in the morning when yeah. nobody else is on the road, but I yep. wait till three. That way, the drunks have time to get yep. home after the bar. One hundred percent. Yeah. So three yeah. a.m. I'm. I would. I would much prefer to do that than drive there during the day yeah. and all the traffic. Yeah. I, I agree. love and I. I just love driving. I yeah. Love no. I. Yeah. I love to just. Is it. Is it weird that as comics we're like, oh, it's only eight hours away? Yeah, you know yeah. what I mean. Yeah. Like, I like, totally. Oh, yeah, I'll drive there for a hundred and fifty dollars. Yeah, no problem. <laughs> no problem. Yeah, Be that's right a real there. fucking thing, yeah. dude. That's a very real thing. And an hour notice. Yeah. Hey, we yeah, need somebody. Exactly. Yeah, yep. I'm sure. Yep. Why are you calling me? I'm eight hours away, but I'll do it. Don't get me wrong. <laughs> <laughs> Isn't there somebody closer? But I'll do it. Steve's I fucking it. stalling out. I'm on my way yeah. right now. Yep. Yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah. Uh, next one, uh, this comes in from Facebook. Uh, mm-hmm. This is from Ben Ramsey. Ben Ramsey. Yeah, he wants to know, how long is too long for a movie theater advertisements? There are too, they are too long already. Right it's now. 10 minutes. It's ridiculous. It's about I, 10 minutes. No, it's way more Isn't than it? that. I do, really? And, and that's the, that's the. It's like 30, No, it's 30 now. It's like 30 or better. All right, I raise you this. How long is too long for podcast advertisements? Ooh. I always fast forward through those too. Uh, I mean, we we don't do reads. I know, but now the little fuckers have figured out that people just fast forward through the front of it. Yeah. So now they do it in the middle. In the and middle. Shit. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. Fuckers. This I, this airplane guy that yeah. I watched, this yeah. pilot guy, he does that. Which shit. one? Mentor, mentor pilot. I love, I love that, that fucking dude, dude. Fuck yeah, that guy is awesome. <laughs> yeah, yeah. That guy like made me not scared of flying. I <laughs> he love made that me guy. more scared of flying. Well, he talks well, about some crashes. I don't want any more pilots except him. Mm-hmm. Like, I, if I fly, mm-hmm. if I ever got like hundred mm, percent rich, I would hire that motherfucker to if fly me. If everywhere. you're into aviation, mentor pilot oh, is the cool. way to go. I, he's very hard to understand sometimes, like, but he's yeah. fucking great. I. I uh, it, Here's Auto the thing, pilot. especially with pod, especially with podcast, uh, <laughs> po- podcast advertisements Nobody like for for our show. Like I, w- I don't want to have a, a person to advertise for that I don't believe in, or right. that I don't yeah. use, or yeah. I don't like. Yeah. Yeah. And we had a uh, one that we advertised for a long time. I'm not going to say their name, but uh, we just basically they they weren't paying us enough. Yeah. Uh, so that's what happened to that. So that's why we got his drug dealer to be a sponsor. Yeah, now. and we don't. Uh, yeah. We don't. We, do we? Okay. I wish, dude. <laughs> he sponsors me. <laughs> yeah. But the thing is, is that like when I, the other thing that I make a stipulation of advertisements on the show is is that I don't want to do the like stereotypical reads that you're just reading yeah. something. I want to yeah, be able to sure. have fun with it, and that's dude, part Tim of my Dillon, deal. Tim Dillon by far has the best reads of any podcaster, I think, yeah. because he, like, dude, he'll tell the most fucked up stories about. You know, like, oh, this guy was a war criminal in Iraq, and now he owns this company, and he killed many, many children, but <laughs> he, he wants you to, yes. to have the and softest best, underwear. Yeah, dude, he's, he's best fucking, friends with the my pillow oh, guy. Dude, it's <laughs> so fucking fun. Like, that's fact, what I'm talking I'll, about. I'll listen to that. Yeah, I mean, it's exactly. funny. You, know? you yeah. don't want to miss it. And I think yeah. that's that's what needs to happen, and that's, I think, why we were so good at it, and that's yeah. why <laughs> that's what you get for not having us anymore. I like it. Anyways, uh, but yeah, I think that especially my cutoff now, now I... I like the previews. You can't do anything about it. It doesn't matter. Yeah. You know, I mean, I guess you get up and take a piss. Yeah, you can show up late, but that's kind of the thing. Is like, no, the movie is supposed to start at eight thirty. You dickheads! I right, don't want the movie yeah, to start right. at nine. Yeah, so yeah, maybe they can that. change that. that. If if it says sure. eight thirty, that's when that bitch starts. Yeah, that's right. what I want yeah, to happen. I agree so with that. if we could do that, then yeah, I don't really give a shit what you have playing when I'm not there. Yeah, so that's mine. How about I like you? it, everybody? Okay, cool. I like it. Uh, next one. This is, comes in from Instagram. This is the <laughs> big white six five. <laughs> Is it's that the, the big, big white, white six, six and a half? Six and a half inches. I, I think Hell yeah. So. Somebody lied to him. Yep. <laughs> I think that's the big white six five is like the big white truck that has a six five liter in it. Yeah. I'm just saying. Okay. But anyways, 
Uh, this is a good question. The, I like this. I do too. Yeah, I, this I, is a good this one. Is a great question. And these uh, are the I, questions I that we want. Stuff like yeah, this. Yeah, Jeremy. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Jeremy, you fucktard. <laughs> My new Facebook friend. Uh. That's good stuff. Uh, but, Stay off my Facebook, <laughs> asshole. <laughs> Anyways, the big white 6'5", uh, he wants to know how close to closing time is too late to go into a restaurant or store? I say an hour for a restaurant and then a store wow, five man. minutes. An I can't give a fuck. Ooh, I wouldn't do yeah, this. I, I, I wouldn't within, do five. If I'm... If I'm uh, if I'm within an hour of their closing time, I know because I've worked in a lot of restaurants. I've worked in the front of the house. I've worked in the back of the house. And I know what's happening, especially if they had like a slow day. They've already put all this shit. Your, the quality of food's probably not going to be near as good as it could have been. Or it might be better because it'll be fresh because they just took it out. And <laughs> yeah. it. But they're pissed. Yeah. They're not happy about it. And if it happens to fall on the floor or something. So it's normally, just, yeah, yeah. Normally, I agree with, I, but I think thirty minutes is is, is thirty minutes good. Thirty minutes, okay. Is good. I don't know. But I was I, we also close at eight. Okay, so yeah. I've already talked to everybody. Look, if somebody comes in here at seven forty-five, right, right, you're still getting out of here at fucking eight thirty. Yeah, it's yeah, early, sure. so yeah. fucking buck yeah. up. Yeah, that's make true. them happy. That's true. Cook yeah. them good food. Yeah, I agree and, with that. and all my people are pretty good about but it. But if it's like but, Walmart or something, <laughs> fuck off. I, I right. needed to go get something. Five minutes. Yeah, fuck off. I'm with like Steve. Yeah. I was literally getting ready to say the only place I really don't give a fuck is is Walmart. Yeah, yeah. because they're supposed yeah. to be open 24 hours, and if they start closing, well then fuck. Dude, that's not what <laughs> yeah. you're supposed to do. Have you seen the TikTok? <laughs> of the, have you seen the TikTok of Diane? Whatever the lady yes. that's signing off <laughs> at Walmart. <laughs> she <laughs> signs off like she's oh when everybody's like, she, like thank you for like your service you're all saluting <laughs> yeah. her and shit this is diane whatever <laughs> signing out yeah. for the last time, the last time, last time. You know, like it's like you know like they do last call on officers yeah, and shit oh god it's hilarious it's, great. it's fucking hilarious it is going everywhere but no i think this is this is a more a question <clears throat> what we do what's something like that that's what our rule for ourselves yeah i am 100 percent with steve i understand that it doesn't bother a lot of the restaurant people if it's a, a half an hour, I don't care. It bothers I don't take that me. risk. It, bo yeah. it doesn't. It bothers yeah. the fuck out of me. I don't want to like for that. For exactly like he said, you don't take that risk. You don't want yeah, your food fucked yeah. up. Exactly, yeah. and, and they and will fuck with they, your food. <laughs> you goddamn right, they will. So, and that's the that's the question. Well, how, do you like your food to have spit in it? Like yeah. this is this is personally the question. yes. Yeah. Well, that's you. <laughs> But I don't even like going to spit I don't, I don't my even steak like going right to, after you spit in my face. I don't even like going to a <laughs> fucking like I even feel bad at a fast food restaurant. You know what I'm saying? Like no. I, I won't even go there. Yeah. Like don't yeah. don't be the douchebag thing. As far as a store goes, um, being in retail, I, I think especially if you're paying cash, thirty minutes. If you're paying credit card. 15 get your shit and get out though don't make them have to count the cash drawer again because mm -hmm. that fucking pisses them off so that's that's okay. where i draw the line all yeah. right all right that's where i draw the line <laughs> <laughs> thank you big that white really grinds six and a half my inch gears <laughs> yeah. you know what really grinds my gears yeah. uh next question comes in from instagram this is grady volkmer grady uh, the german guy it's gotta be with the name like that yep. Uh, but he wants Grady. to know, like finish. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Yeah. Uh, he wants to know what is the maximum number of times can you say "bless you" after someone sneezes? My wife gets one because she sneezes in fucking packs of like twelve, <laughs> and I'm just like, "Fuck off!" After the third one, <laughs> shut up. <laughs> yep. That's, uh, yeah, I yep. don't know. You get a you get a one or two. That's it. After that, it's just. Fuck Annoying. off. Control right. yourself. If I know they're an atheist, I keep on going. God bless you. <laughs> God bless you. Oh, come on. He, just get all In the Jesus' blessings. name, yes. I say bless you, son. Amen. Uh, it's over and over and over yeah. again. Yeah, but if it's my wife, it's it, you're right. It, like, after the first Dude, one. what is that? I bless mean, it's you. just at you. And then at she you, goes at you, again. At you, at you, at you. It's like, what the yeah. fuck is wrong with you? After the third one, you're like, fucking stop it. Yeah. <laughs> you're like, quit it. Yep. yep. <laughs> How about you, JP? Yeah, one. One? Yeah. That's like enough. It. That's enough. Stop I like it. it. I've been blessed. I don't need your fucking blessings anymore. Yeah. You know what? I don't need you to fucking bless me. <laughs> isn't I'm the, blessed uh, enough. Isn't the origin of that because when you <laughs> sneeze for like a, a millisecond, your heart stops or something? Like, no, they thought remember. it was your soul leaving your body. 
Steve doesn't oh. have a soul. Yeah, yeah it's true. I have, I have a red beard. No. No. Yeah. yeah. Oh, he steals all the souls. Yeah, he exactly. steals. Them. He steals exactly. them. Exactly. That's what I get for Christmas. I got red beard too. <laughs> souls. For <laughs> souls. Oh, yeah. All the shitty kids that get coal. It's a mispronunciation. It's you get you get souls stolen. Yeah, that's I love what it. you get. I love it. All right. Uh, let's see. Next one. This is the last one. This comes in from Twitter. This is from Wes Rackley. He Jeez. wants to know. What is the thing that immediately screams trashy parenting to you? Can I just say that these questions were fucking legit? They were great this week. I agree. Great job. Jeremy. Yeah. Take some notes, buddy. <laughs> Holy fuck. Like, fuck these you, were, Jeremy. These were some pretty notes. good thought out. You know, that's good. What, yeah. What is the thing that immediately screams trashy parenting to you when you're walking through Walmart and the parent is yelling at the kid? Like baby talk to not do that again, and like I don't know how to explain it. No, like I get it. You know what I mean? Like yeah. it's just I don't know. I, I get it. Um, uh, I don't know. I, there just needs to be more beating. Yeah, I mean, leash is kind of give it away. <laughs> if you know what I mean. <laughs> if you got your fucking kid on a leash, I love God that. God damn That's it, great. Um, but no, they it's real stupid back white like people. A fucking Marlin. It's like hey, get back here, Trevor. <laughs> It's. I like it. No, I, and I'm with you. I love that you used that's, Trevor. That's yeah, Trevor. Yeah, whatever. Ah, come on. That's definitely his name. Yeah. 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 Uh, but no, I, I I think yeah. <laughs> I think the one that scout. <laughs> scout. <laughs> Man, uh, no, I think uh, I I think there's one that's even more, and I and it happens all the fucking time. But it's it's the parent that is not paying attention to their fucking kid and the kid is destroying like the store. Oh yeah. That's not good. That's, you know, you that, gotta be that, that kid. Yeah. You, I mean, it's one yeah. thing if the, uh, here, and this is me, I can't stand it when kids are crying. By the I, way, I don't I've like never, kids, I've, period. I have three kids that I've never beat before, <laughs> Yeah, but I do root for other and people we'll, to beat their kids. <laughs> right, for sure. But you have four kids. <laughs> Yeah, you just beat the shit out of the other one. I mean, right? Poor guy took the brunt of everything. He's not around anymore. (laughs) There was an accident. Yeah, Yeah, he fell. Something about a plate glass window. (laughs) I don't ever fucking do that again. (laughs) And the other kids learned really quick. I didn't have to beat them at all. (laughs) Exactly. It was awesome. I I love how all of us though really like immediately thought of when you're in Walmart. I think every single one of them. That's how you spot trashy parents. Absolutely, because parents that have their kids at Walmart in general. They, that's where they shop, You're right? <laughs> well, or yeah. big lots. Oh, oh, that's what we. That's even better. The yeah. Dollar General. Are we gonna oh, keep going? Oh yeah, dude. Yeah. Yeah. Aldi's that place is great. Yeah, I love uh, Aldi's. Aldi's how, good. How about you, Aldi's JP? Good. Um, yeah, same kind of deal. Same. I agree with you guys. Wow, nothing, yeah. nothing. Yeah. All right, that's fine. Well, I mean, okay, so we. This happened when I worked at a local convenience store. Can't say. Can I say their name? Uh, Fucking Quick, Quick trip. trip. Yeah. So when I was at Quick Trip, <laughs> you would have you would have parents that came in. Their kids would split. Yep. They would fucking go get themselves a sandwich and whatever and lay it up on the register get a bunch of fucking lottery tickets and cigarettes pull out their ebt cards and the kid would come up and want a bag of chips and they'd be like fuck you put that back you're not getting nothing you know what the fuck like yeah, you know the reason bad. you have that card is to feed your children yeah but they won't even let them get a goddamn bag of chips that's the trash yeah fucking, that's a good one i like yeah. it i like oh it. and you know he you it's can shocking see, how you can, often that happens. And you can see what that person. When looks I worked like. at Central and Oliver, dude, constant. Oh, yeah. I'm sure. Oh, it was yeah, the that, absolute that's a, worst. That's a rough that, one. that store was awesome though because during the day it would be like all the people that live in like millionaires, multi-millionaires. Right. Yep, yep, and yep. That sun goes down. I know, dude. And it's the just whole like fucking, murder. It's just like oh, murder. Oh, you live over no, there, don't yeah, you? Yeah, I know. So, yeah, fucking you know. murder Dillons at Douglas and Hillside. Yes, yes. Murder yes. Fuck Dylan. that, dude. dude that I'll go there sucks. after I'll go there oh, after so work. They never have so any fucking horrible. horrible. No, it's yeah. awful. Dude. I used to live yeah, right so down the street from that Dillons. Yeah. Oh, it's The restaurant's right down the street, so if I need something, I sometimes will stop there. I know right what's Yep, we do the same thing. Yep. For our place. Anyway. That's awesome. Ladies and gentlemen, that's, that's where we draw the line this week. Yay. Great Yay. segment. Great Wee. questions. Uh, and we got more. This time, they're pregnant. <laughs> this time, yes. they're pregnant. We get to move Extremely on to questions pregnant. and preguntas. A lot of you guys had some good ones, so I even threw in a bonus question. Oh, hey. shit. Hey. Yeah, look at that. Uh, but the first one comes in from Instagram. This comes in from George Walker. 
Uh, he mm-hmm. wants to know JJ's dad. <laughs> <laughs> he wants to know what is the worst way for doctors to break the news to parents their newborn is special. Well, how mm. how the doctor do it with your parents? You stole my fucking joke. I'm sorry about that. <laughs> that was pretty, yeah. That, I was just going to say, they just tell them they've got a Scotty. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I, I, I just, you know what? Fuck it. I think you just tell him, eh, he'll be fine. He'll be fine. Yeah. Don't even tell him. No. I, I think. So I, here's the make thing. It, make them find out on their Dude, own. My roommate. I would just say. <laughs> is definitely the hard R. <laughs> yeah. Nobody's told him. <laughs> Dude, I swear to Christ. Dude, I swear to God, he thinks he's normal. Well, I'm the same way. And the way. kid, no, dude, you don't understand. But like, it, he I should have a helmet. Maybe the doctor just says, this kid's going to give out a lot of hugs. <laughs> <laughs> That's a nice this way is gonna to do it. This is going to be a fucking this hug the machine, worst way dude. To do it. This is going to be a fucking hug machine. <laughs> That's the best way to do it. Your kid is going to be a yeah. hugger. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> you know how chromosomes work? Yeah. <laughs> You put an extra one in this fucking kid. That's, yeah. <laughs> that's on you. Yeah. I just delivered him. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I think he might have went without oxygen for too long. Dude, How's that? Can you just imagine if the fucking, the doctor just catches that thing out of some chick's vagina when it gets shit out and then just goes, oh, God damn. <laughs> yeah, like, that's one way to do it. Like, That'd be oh, a bad way. This thing is full oh, shit. Oh. The nurses are all covering their yeah, faces. Yeah. Yeah. They're That'd handing the baby over yeah. like it's a bomb, just like, oh, yep. here you yeah. yeah. like, you're you're go. Hey, you're you guys, get in here. You're going to want to see this. Yeah. 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 Calling other people in. Yeah. <laughs> like Come a, check this out. It's a fucking mutant. Guys, look at this. That's good stuff. That's awesome. All right. Next one uh, comes in from Facebook. This is from Jacob Hazen. Here we go. He wants to know what's a politically correct way to call someone a fucking idiot. He's gonna be a hugger. <laughs> <laughs> Same deal. Yeah. Hey, Mr. Biden. <laughs> oh, ouch. oh, be careful. Uh, n- <laughs> be careful. <laughs> he gets all weird. freaked out, doesn't he? I love that. Oh, it's it is the awesome. best. It's, it is the best. If it's subtle, it's okay. But if it's you know easy, straight. easy, okay, we don't want to well, do politics. How about this? Just hey, Vice President Harris. <laughs> <laughs> That's better. <laughs> you know, tell us a story. Uh, <laughs> tell me about the good old days. Oh uh, man. Yeah. Oh, it's Lord. good. It's uh, good. I, I, I've actually got one that I've heard from a, a friend, a roommate of mine, a long, long time ago, and I thought it was great. Um, but he used to say, if he was talking about somebody who is just so ridiculously stupid, he would go, that dude is slower than molasses dripping off of the shady side of an iceberg in the middle of February. Holy shit. Yeah. I didn't even it know they had molasses long, on icebergs. Yeah. It's, and like, I've thought of that one ever since I was like so hanging out with him. The, the, the art and there is an art to this to be able to tell someone to go fuck themselves or how much of a fucking idiot they oh, yeah. are and then they thank you for it in uh-huh. the end yeah that's ah, fucking <laughs> rough. dude oh my god dude that is oh it's so amazing oh yeah that is the best oh yeah it's so great that dude's head whistles when he runs kind of thing yeah yeah, yeah. that's good shit yeah i love it uh next one uh comes in from facebook this is from jeff friedman uh he wants to know Harry Potter spells that you would use. Okay. I am not a Harry oh. Potter fan. Well, okay. I mean, then, I like it, but it's not like my thing. Here's the thing, man. You can probably put the fucking concept together. Oh, for sure. Yeah. Okay. What spell it's would you use? It's got some magic. It's the little wizard boy. Well, yeah, but I know that you there's could a... use spells. Oh, dude, Silencio. Oh. Yeah. On like, me? No. I like you when you talk. Oh, that's you're cool. All, you're all right. right I do that one where I make my dick bigger. <laughs> you the one where yeah. it makes my yeah, dick bigger. For sure. <laughs> oh, fuck yeah. I think that was in the first episode, yeah. wasn't it? Yeah, I think so. It was. Is. Well, dude, I mean, he runs through a brick wall. Like, something's... You know. Absolutely. I would definitely use the invisible spell. Oh, yeah. Yeah, for oh, sure. I, I would the fucking, fuck out of that. Use dude. the yeah. fuck out yeah. of that one. You'd yeah. be yeah. fucking creepy. And then I'd fuck, oh, with, I'd fuck with people about it. I would totally, <laughs> hey, totally fuck with people about it later. Like, shut hey. and locking the door when you're taking a shit is going to do you no good That's if true. I'm around with That's the invisible true. spell. Well, if you're invisible, yeah, you can't get still, in. You're yeah. still locked out. I'll be in there already. Oh, that's fucked up. Uh, what a creeper. That's so oh, weird. Yeah. shit. Uh, I'll be in there already. Uh, I'll spend hours in there if I have to. Uh, I didn't even think of that. That's I'm, just sit, I'm just sitting in the corner of the bathtub with my robe over me. Fucking. 
Yeah. Jeez. Just ready to jack ready it. Ready to jack it. If I could make if I can make anything or anybody silent. Oh, babies. Yeah, that would that would be one that I would bam. use a lot. Oh, That'd be good. Yeah. I, I like That'd it. That'd be good. I like that. All right. Uh, next one uh, is also from Facebook. It's from Damian White. Damian White. He wants to know rejected names for Pornhub. Ooh. I didn't look at the question. Skin flicks. <laughs> wish somebody skin would have skin I like, flicks. I, I like skin flicks. I wish somebody would have sent these to me before. Doing it for dummies. <laughs> <laughs> Do, doing it for dummies. Doing dot it for com. Dummies. Yeah. Okay. yeah. Yeah. Virginresearch. dot com. Uh huh. Yeah. You know. Um. Hmm. I got. I don't know. I got something brewing. I'm sure. Okay. I don't know. Hmm. Okay. I'm not a big Pornhub fan. Okay, well, what more else? Of a, what an ex-hamster. An ex-hamster? Or, uh, <laughs> or uh, what's the other one? I don't know. Ex-videos? Yeah, something like that. Something like yeah, that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you get on the... Oh, OnlyFans? Huh? OnlyFans? Oh, no. No, I don't see... <laughs> I, have you I, never subscribed to no, somebody's OnlyFans? I never have. I've wanted to. I have. But I just... <laughs> well, I just couldn't fucking... <laughs> Like I don't know. The closest thing I got to that was the chatterbait deal when I read when I read about the oh, senator yeah. that was fucking her husband yeah. on chat. I go, "What's chatterbait?" Is that? Like, <laughs> and then I logged out. on. I was like, "This is fucking amazing." <laughs> uh, and then I got a little addicted to that. I will yeah. say, but no, I never. Yeah, I never have done an OnlyFans. Yeah. I don't know. I feel like my wife would see that thing come out of the account and be like, what, what the, the fuck? <laughs> yeah, for sure. So, But that's, Shatterbait's okay. Well, that's free. It's free. It's free. Yeah. Yeah, just go on there. It's free. Yeah. 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 yeah it's all right. Last time I was on there, I saw somebody dressed like fucking Kermit the Frog jerking it off. <laughs> what so. was the name of that one? Yeah. <laughs> Kermitcoms.com. Yes. Yes. Kermit, yes. Kermit wow. comes. Yeah. Ah, all right. At, that's at, fucking. Yeah. That's fucking great. Okay. Spoogepalace.com might have been a. That would be all one. right. That's yeah, a good that would be fun. Oh boy. All right. Last two questions are for the same person. We in love in the you. pink. Oh yeah. Dot com. T- Taylor. That would have been. <laughs> yeah. I think that's yeah. Yeah. In the pink. That'll work. Yeah. I, like I think that might actually. We might actually start something there. Yeah. yeah it's probably. We, we could just make our own website. Didn't you know Pornhub get to name a uh, stadium in I don't Florida? Know. Hopefully. Pornhub Stadium. That'd be great. I thought they bid to or they got to do it. I'm not sure if that ever hmm. happened. Oh man, I hope Florida's they in Miami. Oh, I hope they won. I mean, that'd be great. I have to Google that. Did you say okay. was it in Florida or was it in Miami? No, 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 no. I, 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 yeah, I know. Okay. I'm just, I. Uh, hmm. It doesn't seem like they're the same though. <laughs> I mean, it's kind of close. Miami's way Born different than the rest stadium. of Florida. It is. It's it really is. It's very different. <laughs> oh, I just I, I just Googled Pornhub Stadium. It says stadium porn videos. <laughs> <laughs> Football it's one stadium chick porn laying videos. on the fifty Sex yard line. What the fuck, <laughs> man? I, for the for the like one time ever, I'm just <laughs> trying to find, and it's like, nope. Here's a bunch of pussy. <laughs> Your phone knows I mean, so you. You got to hit images. Okay, here we go. Oh, no, it was Bang Brothers. The Bang oh, Brothers. Really? Yeah, okay. the Miami Heat Arena was going to be Bang Brothers Arena. <laughs> oh, wow. Yeah. Nice. Yeah, that's awesome. That's fucking great. Good for those that's, guys. I knew I remembered <clears throat> that craziness from something. Well, the last two questions uh, come in from uh, Taylor Moroski, of Fuck course. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Uh, first one, she wants to know uncommon ways to get rid of a boner look at a picture of taylor moraski <laughs> <laughs> oh. i had to say because you know oh, oh, yeah. we have we have funny. a we have a thing that's and pretty funny. i love it yeah uncommon ways to get rid of a boner yeah I just, just slap you it, flip a lot. it into your belt <laughs> That doesn't get I mean, rid of it. Do. Yeah, but you can it walk around it, with it. But it doesn't get yeah. rid of it. Oh, God. I think Mike Baldwin said it best last week. To wear gray sweatpants either has to have a full-on erection or a long shirt. <laughs> 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 I thought that was great. Nice. Uh, yeah, I don't uncommon way. Yell at it, I guess. Yeah, I was going to say. piece just, of shit. Oh, just God. fucking finish I, the job. Catch it in yeah. the, catch it in the yeah. zipper. Catch it in the zipper would work. Oh, oh, dude, that I, would do it. Man. Oh, no. Take, just paper cut the end of your dick. Oh, ah! that'll do it, too. Yeah. Ouch. Yeah. yeah, there you go. Oh, that would be fun. Dude, I no, that, that would hurt. 
I, I, I try to watch. On the pee hole. Oh, right on the yikes, pee hole. dude. It stings Just make every it time. Oh, yeah. Jesus. I and, love it. God damn it. It's hurting me, and I'm not doing anything. I know. Oh, shit. That's great. But no, I like something about Mary watching in that fucking scene. Yeah. It, just, it hurts. It the beans hurts got to, on top yeah. of the frame. The beans got on yeah. top of the frame. Yeah, that was wild. We got a bleeder. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Plus, you'll fucking bleed out if yeah, you catch true. it just right. No, so, true. True. All right. True. And last question. Uh, Taylor wants to know rejected names for Viagra. Mm. Dick Stifter. Mm. Nice. Mm. Nice. Rejected names. Rejected names. Yeah. Sti- I would call it Stiffies. Stiffies is good. Yeah, stiffies. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. The, for- la- the lady's seat. <laughs> the lady's seat. All right. Uh, uh, I don't know. Bottom of the ninth base is loaded. Is what I put. Or fourth okay. fourth and long. Fourth and long. Fourth yeah. and long. I fourth like that long. better. I like that. That's good. Huh. Or round two. Damn. I, I kind of Round two. I like that. Round, round two. two. I like yeah. that. <laughs> I have to pay attention to these fucking things now. Oh, man. It's just like I'm trying to help you. Oh, this is frustrating. <laughs> so frustrating. I don't want to read these stupid fucking questions during the day. <laughs> yeah, no. Hey, you don't have to. Uh, uh, yeah. That's, I don't know, man. I'll think of something later. Yep. Yep. Anyways, ladies and gentlemen, thank you guys so much for participating in what Monday. About the the fun penis day. popper. Penis popper's good. I like that. There you go. That'll yeah, work. It's like a little jalapeno popper. Yeah, they're a little, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Same thing. Spicy. It all has cream cheese. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it sure does. Uh, but thank you guys very much for participating in Monday Fun Day. You can go to all of our socials on Twitter, Instagram, and Facebook.com. Look for Laughing on the Sidelines. You will find us on all of our socials. And I post that every Monday morning. I also write the episode on Tuesdays, so if you haven't gotten a comment in by Tuesday morning, I may not see it. So, there you go. But now we get to move on to a very popular part of every single episode. This is the Laughing on the Sidelines Draft! Yay! All right, ladies and gentlemen, this is this week's Laughing on the Sidelines draft. And uh, Steve won for the very first time. Yay! Way to go, Steve. He, uh, we tied on Twitter, but uh, you took it over on Facebook. So congratulations Fuck on that. Yeah. So that means this week, Steve, you get the championship picks. So that means you're at the end. Oh. I got second. So I get the sandwich picks, and JP was gone last week, so he gets the first overall pick. I think a lot of you guys are going to like this one a lot because uh, we are doing this week, or the draft is going to be, it is going to be the weirdest state laws. Okay? Mm-hmm. Now, if the fucking list has been, re- like, updated since whatever list we're using, sorry, but we'll try to keep our eyes up. But these are uh, supposed to be pretty uh, accurate lists. Uh, so the list, or so the uh, the weirdest state laws, and JP, you get the first pick. Uh, I'm going to go with uh, Nebraska. Nebraska has mm-hmm. a state law that you cannot get married if you have a venereal disease. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> oh, I love it. Uh, which Ooh. is why I'll never get married in Nebraska. <laughs> Nebraska. Yeah. You can't. It's illegal. <laughs> so there's that. I wonder if that law is still legal. <laughs> like if it's still a law. Mm-hmm. I don't know. Um. I get to go, yeah, I get to go, I guess, uh, I like this one a lot. In uh, in the state of Washington, it is illegal to kill Bigfoot. Yeah, yeah, you don't want to kill that. You can't goat. kill him. You can hardly find him. Yeah, can't really find him. <laughs> yeah. It's fucking illegal, though. So, uh, yeah, if you find Bigfoot, you can't fucking kill him. That's a stupid-ass law. Uh, Steve, you get two in a row. Okay. Yeah. In, uh, shit, in Missouri... Okay. Uh, it is illegal to wrestle bears. <laughs> Do they have a lot of bears in Missouri? Exactly. <laughs> uh, okay. And in Vermont, okay. it is illegal for a woman to put in te- fake teeth without her husband's approval. Wow. <laughs> and oh, no. the, the guy that thought of that <laughs> fucking law was getting gummy yeah, blowjobs for yeah. sure. Yeah, he was. I love it. <laughs> Uh, that, that is a man after my own heart. <laughs> That's great. Oh uh, shit. Uh let's see. I do have uh I do have one. 
My next pick is going to be Virginia. In Virginia, there is no hunting on Sundays unless you're killing raccoons. Yeah, because nice. that's a problem in Virginia. <laughs> it's God. If you want to kill, if you want to kill those trash pandas, then go ahead. But there's no hunting on Sundays. When the fuck do you go out and hunt then? <laughs> so dumb. I like uh, it. Yep, JP, you get two in a row. All right, we're going back to Missouri. <laughs> All right. Uh, Sounds like they got quite a few. Nutrition labels cannot be enforced. What? That was Mississippi. Oh, no. Yeah, Mississippi. Okay, oh, sorry. Yeah. <laughs> Mississippi. Nutrition labels cannot be enforced in Mississippi. What? Like they can't put what is They can in? put whatever the fuck they want. Oh, But wow. they can't enforce. They can't say you have to fucking. Oh. Yeah. Man, maybe that's why there's so many, you know. Yeah, like Mississippi. Fucking fat people. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, I get another one? Mm-hmm. Uh, yeah, you get two in a row. In Colorado, you cannot have a couch on your porch. Oh, nice. Jesus. Nice. That would not go over well here in Kansas. <laughs> no, 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 no. We love a good porch sitting. <laughs> yep. <laughs> that's right. Wow, that kind of shocks the shit out of me. Yeah, that's kind of a uh, man. All right. Uh, let's see. <laughs> I, I guess I am going to go with this one. In North Carolina, uh, you cannot have meetings if members are dressed in costume. What the fuck? Well, it seems like that's a lie. Yeah. Because it, like some of the biggest clan rallies of all time exactly happened. That's exactly why. Yeah. That is exactly that's probably why. why. Yeah, they're uh, like, no more of you guys. The law sounds random, but was likely passed to crack down on the Ku Klux Klan. So nice. that's like that's the main reason why. So no costumes. I like it. Um, yeah, I mean, fuck, we have meetings all the time. We're dressed up like crazy idiots. Mm-hmm. Uh, anyways, I don't know about those meetings. <laughs> that is, meetings at work. God damn it. Okay. All right. <laughs> Sounds good. All right. It's weird that you work for the Ku Klux Klan. <laughs> all right. <laughs> is it though? <laughs> <laughs> all right. Uh, go ahead and go, Steve. All right. In North Carolina, we're going back there. It is illegal to play bingo drunk. What? I don't know how the fuck else you would play bingo or why you would play bingo if you weren't drunk. Wow. But that is a real law. Wow. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Uh, and you get one more. Okay. In California, you cannot, it is illegal, you cannot eat frogs that have died in a frog jumping competition. <laughs> <laughs> that happens a lot, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> Poor Hoppy didn't make it. <laughs> Oh, yeah. shit. But don't yep. eat them. <laughs> yep. I, yeah. This, okay. I got to take this one. Okay. It, I don't care. It's great. And it, uh, it apparently it has already been repealed uh, in 2016. But uh, for over a century, New Mexico had a law that stipulated that idiots were ineligible to vote. Yeah, I saw that. That was actually a good one. Idiots like can't vote. I love it. Holy shit. That's half the fucking population. Uh, but anyways, that's the one I'm going to go with. Okay. I like it. <laughs> I love that one. I like it. Uh, JP, these are your last two. All right. The first one we're going to go with uh, in Delaware. Mm-hmm. You cannot Favorite s- state? You cannot sell dog hair. Mm-hmm. What? Yeah, can't do it. I've got, I know. Not? I've gotten busted for that. Oh, that's times. right. Well, that's why. Yeah. I, that's yep. why I don't live in Delaware. Exactly. <laughs> How else am I exactly. supposed to make my living? Yep. Oh, I know. Jesus. Dog, okay. Dog hair merkins. That's, that's what I do. Mm-hmm. All right. <laughs> uh, Lord. <laughs> Shit. Uh, and then you get one more there, JP. Oh, this is my last one. This huh? is your last mm-hmm. one. Make it a good uh, one. In LA, you cannot hunt moths. <laughs> under street lights. <laughs> what? That's a thing. That is, is illegal to hunt moths wow. under street lights in LA. Now you can do it as long as you're not under street light. Hunt all the moths you want. Oh, that's awesome. But you can't do it I under like street it. light. <laughs> I like it's entrapment. That. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Oh man, I've got a couple of um I've got a couple of honorable mentions. Oh, but do I get one more? You have one more pick, but it's my pick right oh, now. Okay. So, so I'm I'm gonna go with my very last pick, and uh, I like this one too. But in New Jersey, uh, it is a law that you cannot be wearing a bulletproof vest while Why committing commit a, a murder. I like that. That's, <laughs> That's great. Nice. Yeah, kill everybody, but yeah. don't wear don't a vest. Don't wear a vest. God damn it. 
All right. So that is my last uh, weird law. Steve, this is your final pick. <laughs> in Alaska, it is illegal to whisper in someone's ear while they are moose hunting. <laughs> that seems like it happens all Somebody the time. Somebody took his wife moose hunting and then made a <laughs> fucking law is what I think happened. That's exactly what I think happened. It was like, we're going to put a fucking stop to this shit right now. Oh, uh, shit. You can't say nothing when I'm getting ready to pull the exactly. goddamn trigger. Exactly. Oh, Jesus Christ. All right. Do you have any honorable mentions? I don't. Yeah. In Palm Springs, California, you cannot walk your camel. <laughs> well, thank God. <laughs> oh, wow. Oh, wait. Where was the one? Oh, it's know. only illegal to walk it down Palm Canyon Drive between the hours of 4 and 6 p.m. Oh. I think it was in Ohio. It is illegal to tether a giraffe to a light pole. <laughs> <laughs> Tie him wherever you want. Just yeah. not on our light pole. Exactly. <laughs> in fucking Kentucky, there's no reptiles in religious services. Allowed. Oh, that's great. That's great. Yeah, that's because they're fucking shaking snakes and shit. Mm -hmm. um, here's one for our great state of Kansas, uh, which I didn't know this, but... Mm -hmm. Apparently in Kansas, no ice cream on cherry pie. <laughs> what? Yeah. These motherfuckers. These motherfuckers are I'm gone too eating, far. I'm not eating cherry pie without some vanilla little ice cream well, on top. At least top. I'm not anymore. I'm going to do that on yeah, purpose. Fuck sure. that shit. Just make I sure like that nobody takes a video of no, it. No kidding. You'd be in big I'm trouble, big mister. Deep I like shit. it. Uh, but like yeah. It. Anyways, anybody else have any other ones? Or that that's what it. That's man. what we're doing. I think that's it. Uh, I gotta I actually do have one last one. Hawaii. Guess what? It's bill billboards are actually illegal in Hawaii. Oh so, wow! Yeah. I could okay. I dig that. Yeah. Uh, but anyways, ladies and gentlemen, that is this week's draft. You can go. This one we can actually put on fucking Facebook. Hey, this has been <laughs> yeah. a while since we could. <laughs> yeah. Do that. Uh, we did get the, the one last week actually did stick around. So, uh, yeah, it did. It did. So uh, it was nice. conversations you don't want to bring up at Thanksgiving uh, yeah. dinner. But yep. surprisingly, it stayed up there. There was a couple questionable ones, but that's okay. Uh, but yeah, this week, uh, it will be up on facebook.com slash laughing on the sidelines. Uh, you can click on the corresponding emoji of the list that you like best, uh, that have the weirdest laws. And you can also go to Twitter, which is at L O T sidelines and vote there as well. Whoever nice. wins next week, I don't know, gets, uh, gets a pat on the back. Nice. Yeah. Uh, but now we get to move on to my favorite part of every single episode. This is the laughing on the sidelines shitty situation of the week. Right, ladies and gentlemen, this is this week's Laughing on the Sidelines shitty situation brought to you by Vorshay's Lounge. Yay! Vorshay's Lo Cocktail Lounge here in Wichita, Kansas. What a shithole. <laughs> That's a badass bar. Dude, I love that place. Where the Very drinks nice. are cold and the cougars are hot. Damn skippy. That's no bullshit. Dude. Uh, dude, they, I'm telling you, it is a cougar den. 100%. It is I know. Yeah. It's incredible. That's yep. why I don't like it. I, I love it. I saw a threesome, uh, uh, a pre-threesome happen up in the balcony. I, I, yep. <laughs> I, mean, like, yep. yep. I remember. It's a good it's a place. Shocking. Yep. It was just absolutely shocking. I mean, there were two smoking hot chicks and one lucky guy. Fuck oh, that guy. Just That's a uh, sweet kid. Uh, a sweet, yeah. He's yeah. a sweet kid. Son of a bitch. You know, you have no idea what it costs Steve to fucking have them go do that. Exactly. <laughs> that yeah, I need the advertising, yeah, too. Yeah, make a wish. Oh, yeah. Good old Vorshays. But anyways, this is brought to you by Vorshays Lounge here in Wichita, Kansas. Uh, Steve, do we have any uh, good comedy shows coming to Vorshays anytime soon? Yes, we have CJ Starr coming up from D-Town. My oh. used to be hometown Dallas. Uh, December 14th, and then after that, we have got Tom Takar coming uh, in February. We have Gareth Reynolds in February, and Ben Jones yeah. in February as well. Yeah, I think about every weekend in February, we've got comedy. Have mm -hmm. you seen CJ? Yeah, before. Yeah, I've been on I shows love, with him. I like yeah. CJ. Yeah, yeah, yeah for like sure. I'm off. actually on that show. Yeah. Wow. So, yeah. Right on. Yeah. Well, that's well, kind of I'm going. Yeah, yeah exactly. Fuck, I wasn't going to yeah. go if it was just CJ, but <laughs> <laughs> you're going to be on. I'm in. I like how he said, I like how he said hey, I'm actually going to be on that show. You're in charge of making the goddamn list, dude. No, 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 no. That's a show that somebody else had, and he asked me to just be on the show. Wow. And I was like, okay, cool. Good for you. Yeah, it was oh, good. It's like you're good at it. Yeah, I know. It's yeah. freaking weird. Weird. Oh, dude. I had a murderous set when I opened for Chris Porter the other week or whatever. Oh, fuck. That was 
Yeah. Yeah. That was, you that would was have one to, for the that was one for the ages. You though. would have to sure. open it for Chris. Oh, you would dude, have to fucking so kill good. it. That's felt awesome. So cool, fun, man. Good. It was very so cool. fun. So fun. Chris was great. Yeah, yeah. Anyways. Uh, but anyways, yeah, this week, uh, this week's laughing on the sidelines shitty situation is would you rather <laughs> only be allowed to go into restaurants five minutes before they close? <laughs> or what was the other one? Be the be the Oh yeah, that's right. Yeah, have be a the, full-time job <laughs> telling new parents that they've had a special child. Oh, <laughs> uh, that's right. You've had a little Scotty. Your job is to be the one who breaks the news to the parents that their child is going to be a special needs child. Mm-hmm. For me that's easy. I think it's easy for me too. Yeah, I'm yeah. going to be the I'm going to be the guy that tells the parents for they have a special sure. needs child. 100% all day. Yeah. 100%. Yeah, yeah, okay. It's not even close. It's unanimous. Because, yeah, no, it's not. Because I mean, go with me on this i mean after a while don't you think you get really good at it and you don't care a yep. or b yep. your ways of doing it get so much more creative and fun. that would be me <laughs> yeah i would try to you be could, you could take a matt rife approach to that just have a wrapped helmet yeah that, that you, you just, just hand them, them. Yeah. yeah and then be like, You're gonna need like this. what's this yeah. for and they're like <laughs> you'll oh see. no uh, you'll see yeah. Yeah. yeah but i just think a little I picture mean, of bring a short, him in <laughs> picture yeah. of a short bus right there yeah. with him already it's awesome and it like also it. If, i mean like you also get to fuck with people if it's not you know it's yeah. just like oh that's my god ah, i'm that just kidding true. i'm just fucking with you yeah it's some like, dude yells at his wife this is your fuck yeah. you dumb bitch <laughs> yeah this came from your great. side of yep, the family 100 percent oh, 100 percent <laughs> yep <laughs> I love it. Oh man, I just thought of a different situation. Would be oh, be so oh when you worse. accidentally swapped out a black kid for a white kid just to, watch, just to watch the dad freak the fuck out. That'd be great, dude. Oh, here's that your was, son. You'd go fucking <laughs> nuclear. I'd be like, I fucking knew it. I cheated on you with my fucking secretary nine times. It's like, psych. <laughs> no, what's wrong, baby? Yep. You motherfucker. Uh, Oh, yeah, that'd be great, dude. I love it. Or just an Asian kid. I mean, this one's going to be good at math. Oh yeah, that'd be fucking awesome, dude. I love it. Oh, shit. Oh, that's great. Oh, that, that's that's awesome. why we don't work in hospitals. I know. <laughs> they don't let us they in there. Would not, my daughter is a nurse, but I am probably not allowed. Does to As you say, you're not allowed yeah. in there. Nope. No, oh, you would be fucking with people oh, on yeah, a yeah, regular that, basis. Yeah, it, it wouldn't be good. No, it'd yeah. be fucking hilarious. Like, well, I watched Patch Adams. This is supposed to be helpful. <laughs> 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 oh, shit. Well, ladies and gentlemen, thank you so, so very much yeah. uh, for tuning in to another uh, episode of the Laughing on the Sidelines podcast. Guys, thank you guys so very much for commenting and sharing our TikToks. That mm-hmm. helps us grow the show. Uh, quite a few of you did that over this last uh, this last week. Thank you very much. And welcome to all those new listeners. We do sincerely appreciate it. Uh, thank you very much to Mr. Steve Peters. Appreciate you coming by again. Hello, hello. Thank uh, hope you. Hope that you can continue to come on as often as hell you are. Yeah, everybody man. loves you. I like it. But uh, not as much as everybody loves Mr. JP. Yeah. He just... should have had glitter. And who can blame him? <laughs> yeah. Oh, I do. I just haven't got it out yet. Uh, yeah, I, like so it. I got I got a bag of glitter dicks over there if you want to just start nice. spreading nice. that. It's a go. bitch to clean up, but, you know, that is what it is. I like it. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you guys so very much. We sincerely do appreciate it. And as we always like to say, guys, do us a favor. If you like us, tell your friends. And if you don't like us... We hope that you get arrested for eating frogs from the jumping contest <laughs> in California. <laughs> <laughs> If you don't like us, tell your enemies, guys. And until next time, I'm a pepper, you're a pepper. Wouldn't you like to be a pepper, too? (laughs) Until next time, keep laughing, Laughing assholes. assholes. We will see you later. Take care. Bye.